what happens whenever they decide they don't like another atheist out there? Well, <laughs> they history just argue with them. Seems to show us all the way back history to the day of Joseph Stalin, atheist dictator, <laughs> killed six million people in the, na- oh in the name of atheism. Yeah. <laughs> How many atheists? What about Hitler and Mussolini, Biden? who are both Catholics? They owed it all. Did, did, did what? It- uh, I think Zayo, you can you Dong? rewind it? I like, think he's talking about Mao. Actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He says Zao. Mao. Just, Zayo just listen to Dong. how he pronounces this. <laughs> Zao de Dong. <laughs> okay, just listen. Zao de Dong. <laughs> listen to the whole sentence. Joseph Stalin, atheist dictator, killed six million people. How many of those people do you think were other atheists, huh? I don't know. How many atheists do you think got killed during the reign of Zao de Dong? <laughs> Zayo da dong. Zayo da dong. Zayo. I almost like that better, dude. It's like Zayo. It's, like, it's like a fucking da dong. You, Zayo. You know what Zayo da dong sounds Zayo like? Zayo da dong. It's like some performance artist name they would give a character in a movie. Let's go to the Zayo da dong concert. Zayo da dong. Zayo da dong. <laughs> what a retard, Brett. Oh Why my you, god. How are you for real? <laughs> you know what you were talking about? Like, like, say old or no. If Brett revealed like he was like like a British thespian or something one day, like <laughs> how, how he portrayed uh, this was all like a fucking character. No way. No, nobody, I, I nobody... mean we know it's not true. Oh, dude, he's this dumb. But that would be amazing. That's the only way Brett could be redeemed. <laughs> say old or no, dude. Like, I, know. I can't get over it. Like another atheist. Well, history seems to show us. All History. the way back to the day of Joseph Stalin, <laughs> the atheist dictator, killed six and nine. Oh, yeah, Brad. <laughs> all the atheists <laughs> killing all the people, dude. Zayo de Dong! How many atheists do you think got killed during the reign of Who knows? Zayo de Dong? The reign? <laughs> Did he say the reign? <laughs> the reign? <laughs> the reign of hold Zayo the reign. de Dong! <laughs> the reign. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Did he, he said say the reign. He oh, says the rind. I think got killed during the rind of <laughs> Zayo de Dong. <laughs> the rind of Zayo de Dong. How, Brett, how are you so uneducated and fucking stupid? The rind of Zayo de Dong. really does exemplify white trash, ignorant <laughs> motherfucker from Missouri. <laughs> yes, yeah, the, the rind, r- dude. <laughs> the rind of Zayo Dadon. The rind of Zayo Dadon. What the fuck? I don't even what? know how this is possible, dude. The rind of Zayo Dadon. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you the even get that? Where'd you even get the Z? Where did it come from? Of Zayo Dadon. Mao Zedong. Oh. <laughs> Zayo da dong. Zayo da dong, dude. The rhyme oh. of Zayo. Oh my god, there, look at this goof. Uh, there's another, uh, the Keenism dictionary oh gets my god, ever larger, dude. dude. Oh ever my larger. fucking god, I can't even handle Zayo that. Zayo da dong. I'm <laughs> fucking crying, my throat hurts. The rhyme of Zayo da dong. The rhyme? Zayo da dong. The rhyme of Zayo da dong. Brad, just stop trying. Oh man, not a take two on that one, huh? Not a take two. Well, you you just <laughs> you just fucked it up. <laughs> now he now he's got a the fucked rind. up name. You blithering oh, fucking the fuck. rind of you, the said, you stupid <laughs> sack of shit. The atheists you think got killed during the reign of <laughs> Zayo de Dong. What a fucked up name that guy. God, got, I can't right? believe Brett's a real person. What a stupid what a fucking up name that guy. Uh, the the rind. rind of Zayo de Dong, dude. <laughs> oh my what god, what the fuck god, I, <laughs> I can't <laughs> even. I'm oh. not fucking. Oh my god. The rind. I can't do it, dude. I can't do it. God, He's so dude. fucking stupid. <laughs> It's You're, so real. How, how, is, how does so Brett exist? Stupid. The rise of Zayo the dog, dude. I think I just got a fucked up name, don't you? Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. What is this? Oh, my fucking God. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh. Let's I just, just let it I, 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 don't, I can't even imagine a human worse than Brett. He just fails on every conceivable level you can imagine. He's he the most disappointing human it's being. It's like ever. he can't. It's like it's like every time you think Brett is just like it has reached the lowest depths possible. He just he's, he always surprises you. Oh my God. No.
Welcome to the Drunken Peasants Podcast. This podcast is made possible by the support of viewers like you. You can support this podcast on Patreon by using the Amazon links in our description section to do your shopping, by signing up for Loot Crate using our official link, or by contributing via Super Chat if you're watching us live. If you have a video or suggestion for the Drunken Peasants, please label it clearly and send it to the Drunken Peasants Facebook inbox. You may also send fan art and pictures of you wearing or sporting our merchandise. Please do not send personal messages, as these will be deleted unread. Thank you for supporting the show. And with all that shit out of the way, here is the Drunken Peasants Podcast. <laughs> Cast. From the frigid armpit of America, this is the Drunken Peasants Podcast with Ben and TJ, bringing you opinions of the news from an altered perspective. Fuck it! <laughs> you got a joint? Uh, no, not on me, man. I don't have facts to back this up. It'd be a lot cooler if you did. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, atheist? You okay. You're nothing, okay. TJ. You're garbage. Okay. I just want to no, no, be no, light. No, no, You're no, garbage. No, no, no. <laughs> and now, here are your hosts, Ben and TJ. We'll do it live. Okay. We'll do it live. Fuck it. Do it live. Fucking, Fucking thing, thing sucks. sucks. Welcome to the Drunken Pests Podcast, episode 371. Yeah, 371! The Rhine of Zeo de Dong! <laughs> the Rhine of Zeo de Dong! Yes, the Rhine just begun. of Zeo de Dong! May everyone watching this podcast tonight be blessed by, by the, the Rhine of Zeo de Dong! I, I saw someone in the chat during the intro there say, This was on the private show, I need to become a patron. Absolutely. I mean, this is a sign. Suck our Zeo de Dongs, bitch. I mean, how do you miss shit like that? Oh, yeah. Paul, I just want you to know I have a headache and I'm tired, so you got to carry the show, dude. You got to carry it. <laughs> Ben's tired, too. He's got a hangover. Scotty, obviously, you're useless. So, Paul, it's all on you tonight, buddy. I hate to tell you guys this, but I am fucking wasted. It's dude. all I on you, drunk. Paul. I have. Paul! I, I drank a gallon of wine before uh, I started tonight. Scotty, would you punch Paul? You punch pu- Paul how about I face? punch you and your ugly fucking How about you face? punch Paul? Oh, Jesus. How about dude. you do something useful I, I, for once and punch ca- the person who needs offer. to be punched? How about I slap you upside your fucking head? No, I already got a headache. I don't need that shit. Good. You listen? Why don't you fucking listen I when people talk, dumbass? You're stupid as fuck, Scotty. You're stupid as fuck. I am listening, to you, you're you're stupid am listening fuck. to you. You're stupid I'm as fuck. Of TJ hasn't smoked in two days, so pretty soon he'll make... <sighs> Pretty soon he'll make a video on his channel saying that he's had he had his last cigarette and then he'll smoke one the next day. Oh, yeah. so who's ready for the super chat? That's what's show. really going on, isn't it, TJ? What's happening? The super chat. You're having the fidgets over some cigarettes, dude. What do you he want is. from me? Yeah, that's what it is. That's what this headache is. Shut your fucking fat mouth. Shit. Headache is that monkey, dude. <laughs> what is your problem, Scotty? What's your fucking problem, bitch? Problem is you. <clears throat> Been a problem since day fucking one for me, bitch. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is the is the ride on my coattails getting bumpy? Yeah, it <laughs> is, bitch. You'll make some more fucking money, you worthless sack of shit. I would if YouTube would stop fucking me. Oh, it's YouTube. It's fault. YouTube's you fault. You know what? You lost it, buddy. You lost it. You used to be a contender. Hey, yeah, guys. Up. Earlier today, used to be shut up. Something. Earlier today, we used to wa- we, we were watching uh, the room, right? Yeah, the room. Yeah, I was yeah. doing some research. Another reason to become a patron. Yeah. If you become a patron now, you could see our review of the room. The rum. Yeah. It'll yeah. be the posted rum. soon. But dudes, I, I I was looking it up, and I know we got some other shit we got to get to shilling in a minute here. But uh, are any of you familiar with with Tommy Wiseau's original planned ending of no. the room? No. Yes, because that was not his intended ending. He was, actually had a very different ending in mind. Yeah, in, in the original version, he uh, the character Johnny commits suicide, learning his best friend and and uh, soon to be wife have betrayed him. Well, that's what the, that's the version that was shot. That's the version that was, was shot. The version that was written was quite different. In the uh, in the version that Tommy was so wanted to do, <laughs> at the end of the film, he gets in his car and his car flies away, and it's revealed that he's a vampire. What? Are you serious? Yes, I am one hundred percent serious. What? Uh, how does that have anything to do with anything? That would have been the best <laughs> ending. I ever. know, right? It's why, did they stop? Well, t- why did they do a different budgetary on. reasons? Yeah, they couldn't do it. He asked his production crew if there was any way they could convincingly do that special effect on their budget, and they told him And no. his car flies away? Yeah, his car flies away, and, and I guess it a flashes a close-up of his face, and he smiles, and he's got the fucking vampire teeth. And that's the end. Isn't that the end of, like, Back to the Future? They get in the car and fly away? Uh, Yeah, it's also kind of yeah. like the end of Grease, too. Yeah. 
and the end of Fright Night. A lot of, it's a like lot of all movies of that rolled into one. A lot of movies end with flying cars or vampires. So cool. There you go. Let's talk about all the important shit now. Yeah. Today, uh, the drunken well, not peasants. Today, August twenty second. Meetup. Drunken peasants. Fucking Seattle meetup at the Fun House. It, it's a, it really should say show and meetup. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not. This is not just your everyday meetup. This is a. This is really more of a, a stage show plus a meetup. <laughs> we're gonna be hanging out with fans, but we're also gonna be up on stage doing shit. We got Billy the Fridge. He's going to do a little set. Yeah. We got... Uh, Billy. VIP is sold out. VIP is completely sold out. Which is funny because when we when we said, hey, $75 VIP, people in the chat were like, nobody's going to buy that. And that yeah. sold out fucking super in fast. Like a week and a half to two weeks. Yeah, so yeah, we get, your, get your tickets. They're 15 bucks, $20 if you wait until the night of. Or you can give TJ a hand job. Why so, wait? You know. Why wait? Get your tickets now. Come link to the, the Seattle meetup. Link in the description to follow, to RSVP and to get uh, your tickets under Ticket Fly. Ticket Fly. Do it. Do it. Do fly. It. Ticket a ticket. It's at fly a great venue. Tickets. It's a fun time. You really should. And you may you may see the peasants fight because of Paul's load beard. He says he's going to attack whoever uh, the yeah. person who loads beards him and the nearest peasant. Yeah, the nearest peasant and whoever load bearded me is gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna at least take a swing at. So let's just stay away. So from we Paul. have we have an admission on video that Paul plans to possibly to assault, assault someone. Yeah, to assault us. Wait yeah. a minute. What is throwing cum in somebody's I beard? Hold on. Though. You, <laughs> hold on. Do it, yeah, well, I'm not going to load beard you. I didn't do it. If uh -huh. I know if yeah, I do but, it, but, I, but I you, you're you're encouraging it. I've never encouraged give you the right to assault once, me. I've never encouraged it. I, excuse me. I have never once encouraged. Tell it to the I judge, said, Paul. Tell I've it said to the Paul judge. In a satirical manner. Paul. All I have said a is that it manner. would be hilarious if someone did if that. If someone were to do it, it would be funny. <laughs> yeah, we have no way. No encouragement it. whatsoever. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not encouraging it. Yeah, yeah. I actually will tell people right now, Paul, do not do not load beard, Paul. There you go. But if it happened, it would be funny. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Don't do it, but if you do do it, that's fucking there's also, hilarious. Funny. There's also two promotional offers going on right now. Yeah, DP on CP Demand. Summer Sales. DP On Demand, 33% off. Link in the description. Uh, you get to see the post show. It People love the, the fucking post, post show. Post show. We Who do one after almost show? every episode. <coughs> yeah, there'll, yep. there'll be one tonight. Yeah, we're yep. going to do one tonight. 25% off of select merchandise in our Teespring store, basically. Most of it. Yeah, anything I think that's over like... I, I don't I don't we don't know the exact yeah. math, but most of the shirts are twenty five percent off. Uh it's kind of a weird thing you have to do, it's but the directions so are in the um Yep. In the link below. or whatever. So you have to just, add question mark PR equals DP summer to the URL. To the end of the, of the shirt URL of the shirt. Want. Yeah. And then you get twenty five percent off. That's it's it. stupid, but that's how you get twenty five percent off. So be sure to do that. Motherfuckers. <laughs> don't burp on the show, that's unprofessional. You Fuck do it you, all bitch. the time. It's part, it's part of my show. This is the show, oh, this part is of the my show where we had the duty stain segment. That was a weak burp, too. It wasn't even a fucking major Yeah, it was burp, just dude. like a little adjustment burp, TJ. Why are you so sensitive? Yeah, fuck you, TJ, you piece of fucking Don't push shit. me, Scotty. I'm pushing you. Don't, Don't push, push me, Scotty. Me. Push you. Don't push me. Do? What are you going to do? Don't Touches, push me. Touch his collarbone. Do? You're you tearing me apart, Scotty! <laughs> can't handle this. You betray me. You all betray me. That's, I'm done with this I world. I fed up with this world. Man, that fight scene in that movie. Apparently, uh, pro that, wrestling man. looks more real. Well, than apparently, oh, much uh, more real. apparently, one of those dudes, uh, the guy who played Mark, uh, was actually hurt during that scene. Oh, yeah. Yeah. he was pushed pretty hard. Honestly, you can see it. He uh, tore it his wasn't. ACL. It wasn't during the pushes. It was. Oh, uh, really? He said it was Tommy's grip. Tommy's wow. grip. Yeah, he said that Tommy was grabbing him really hard. Well, don't fuck with Tommy. Was so, dude. He said he has a grip like a fucking cyborg, fucking cyborg. or some shit. Shh. So maybe he really is a vampire. Grip. You know, you never know. If Tommy was a vampire, load beard Paul. No, we're we're telling people not to do that. Do not load beard Paul. Do but not be load. Beard <laughs> but it would be Paul. fucking hilarious if it happened. But don't do it. But don't You're just do encouraging it. it for it'd be epic. Not. It'd be we're the not funniest fucking shit that ever happened in anyone's life ever. Even if we're assaulted by but Paul, don't do it. we're gonna be ro don't rolling do it. on the floor laughing. So uh, but don't do it. Troll or not a troll? I think we have one, yeah. Cool. Yeah. yeah, we do have one. All right, here it is. What are you thinking today, TJ? Uh, I feel like this is going to be a troll. I feel it's like it's going to be not a troll, bitch. Mm, let's see. Let's take a look. Yes, my birthday is March 7th, <laughs> what? but July 19th was the day I found out I was black. Like, this whole, my whole entire life. My, my whole entire life, yo. You're black. I never believed her because I knew I was black, but... 
Look in a fucking mirror, bitch. Uh, she looks pretty black to me. Now she looks tan. I mean, like, she looks like she might lay out in the sun or go to a tanning salon or something. I, I know a Nubian so princess when I see one, Ben. Oh, yeah, that, that perfectly straight hair. Yeah. That perfectly straight brown, light brown hair. Well, you can straighten your hair, man. Yeah, yeah you man. There's no black hair. girls running out there with straight hair. Come on now. Black yeah, girl. but Come on, they straighten their hair. Like this. You know, maybe she feels like she's black in her soul, dude. She feels I'm like she's black. She and did. There you go. She went on Ancestry.com and, yeah. and she found out she was 45% well, 25. Black, 25. Well, if you're 25%, I mean, you can say that you have black ancestry, but yeah. you really can't say that you're entirely black. I mean, I don't know. Like, what is she black? Yeah, what is the percentage? Like, you know, can you like Uncle Ruckus if you're like 50.1% white, you're white? I don't know. Uh, I consider that to be my birthday because it's just a very exciting holiday for me. So I thought I'd celebrate. I okay. I house to celebrate. Troll. I say it was my birthday. So that's just a You don't talk that way normally. For y'all. That is a troll. Yeah. Yeah. troll. This has to be a troll. Troll. Oh, Yo, no. y'all, I'll tell you what I think. It's like, no, you don't talk like that. You're, that's, you're probably putting that affectation on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Man, man whoa, Scotty, how you going to tell her how, how you going to say talks? that? No. How, she, how you going to tell, tell her how she talks? I knew these comments were coming, that I would I fuck her comments. Her. I fuck her. It's a wig, yeah. wigger for life. I fuck be a wigger. A troll, yeah. but I fuck be her, a wigger. That's a troll. Chat, right keeping it 100, as, a, as usual. All right, troll. Yep. It's a troll. <laughs> troll. Gotta agree with TJ, even though he's normally wrong. Lol. Wrong yeah. about everything. I, I'm telling you guys, pull, pulling fucking news is impossible unless you just Trump, want a Trump, cavalcade Trump, of Trump, Trump alum. Trump, 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 Trump. I'm not surprised. It's just Trump, 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 Trump. Did I Trump mean, say this? Did Trump tweet this? I Did mean, Trump delete this tweet? I'm, I'm not surprised that that they talk about him because he's Donald fucking Trump. He became president somehow, and now he's not even what like he's six months into his presidency and he's already talking about pardoning himself. Yeah, I mean it's it like, is a little crazy, uh, but. You'd think there's other things in the world going on. Who was that celebrity we we heard talking about him, uh, or we saw there was an uh, a story? It was uh, <laughs> Hellboy, right? Ron yeah, Perlman, yeah, dude. Ron Perlman. Yeah, there there was a CNN story. Ron Perlman sounds off on Trump's tweets or some shit, and it's just like, why are we listening to Ron Perlman talk about Trump? Because we need to know every single person, <laughs> every opinion. angle on Trump, even what Ron Perlman thinks. What does Ron Perlman of the Hellboy films think of Trump? I think he sucks. Well, you know what? Maybe, you he, ha here, maybe he has some insights into Donald Trump. That Hellboy we thinks it sucks. <clears throat> oh, yeah. All right, so are we going to bring these soapbox motherfuckers on? Yeah, that okay. might be a good All right, idea. These fucking soapbox people. These soapboxers. They fucking better respond this time. Yeah. Soapbox people. You better be ready to fly. Me. If you're not fucking ready, soapbox people, we're going to slap you. These soapbox slap you. people. Revolting I'm to the core. Call them both. Call them both at once. Call them it's both. Uh, Egghead Prime and uh, and the Meds Peds. Yep. The Meds Peds. Rattlesnake. We haven't uh, Rattle checked snake. in to see how Egghead Prime's life has changed since, since he's yeah. becoming since Egghead becoming, Prime. Becoming yeah. the Prime. Hey, how's it going? It's hey, going pretty well. Egghead Prime. How's, hey, it, egghead how's it going Prime. there, Primester? How are you doing today? Pretty good. Can't hey. complain too much. How's it the uh? Worked. Yeah, yeah, Success. you got to work in this time. No, it yeah. didn't. So, uh, which which amongst you wants to go first? Who wants Hold their on. one minute? Go we got to set shit up first. Yeah, yeah we're getting. Let's we'll do our timer. We're don't getting get your, ahead uh, of yourself, first, Paul. Time. She can go first this time. Don't get oh, ahead oh. of yourself, Paul. Yeah, we're we're getting your cameras uh, set up. You people, you're disgusting. All right, so TJ, tell me when you're ready, then we'll start. Hold up. Oh, we're well, we're having technical difficulties. Really, it, just, you know, it takes a second to get it's a bunch cameras. of bullshit. It's cool. TJ, entertain the people <laughs> with a witty anecdote. A witty anecdote? Yes. Um, one time, Paul was taking a shit in uh, the bathroom Ooh. at my house. Uh huh. And uh, I went in there afterwards, and he didn't flush the toilet. Ugh. And, okay. Uh, it was just fucking bloody. And I'm like, Paul. <laughs> what? Dude, you fucking, you need to see a doctor or something. Your shit's like just blood, and he's like, "Oh, don't worry, that's typical. That's typical for me." And I was like, "Oh, what? 
I don't remember this happening, but I'll, I'll believe you because I do. I mean, your shit is normally blood. Is every other shit is just blood. Yeah. Every other shit. See, the story's changing now because you said pretty, pretty much. You told me before, pretty much every shit is blood. Every shit. I mean, is every bloody. other shit or so. Every okay. Shit so it's you know, but it is blood. It's is fairly it, common for you to just shit blood. Is it red blood or is it like dried up, like black? No, it's. It's it's like fresh blood, like fresh? A, like a half gallon. So you have of like fresh hemorrhoids blood. or something. Whoa. Uh, I don't know, dude. My bowels are dude, probably Paul's asshole is just a giant hemorrhoid. Bleeding dude. from your ass is, is no. I'm actually to get kidding. I don't out. bleed from my ass. I don't know where that came oh, from. Okay. <laughs> TJ's ass anecdote was a complete lie. With Paul, I'm sorry. Okay, so uh, I guess it's time for uh, one of you people to All talk. Right. We'll start with the med peds. Start the time. Or whatever the, the fuck. timer is starting now. Go. Ah, um, honestly, I don't know if I can fill up a whole minute this time because I have nothing new to shill. But um, yeah, just come check out my channel, which is the meds peds, just like you know my Skype name. Um, it's political commentary, totally uh, unique and new. I'm trying to get away from the whole social justice thing because it's a bit overdone. So I'm trying to incorporate, you know, like new age stuff and anti-vaxxers and all sorts of, you know, spicy original things. So, yeah, that's really all I got. Uh, sorry about Friday. No one ever used the web version of Skype because it has this cool little uh, feature where it doesn't allow you to accept calls. So I don't <laughs> recommend that. It's a great feature. Oh. Yeah, it's a great feature. Yeah. But that's pretty much it. I don't know, All right. Myself. So, thank you. Thank you. Check out her channel. Yeah, check out the meds. Check out the channel. meds. Peds. The meds. Peds. Yes. Petty meds. Get them. Let Taste us. Uh, Eat let em. us. Let us hear from Egghead the Prime now. Prime Egghead. All right. Prime. Go. So I'm also here to shill a similar shit that I shilled last time. This awesome beanie. Look, summer's about to wind down. You're gonna you're gonna need some headwear, and you should wear this one right here and you can get it at etsy.com slash shop slash okay crochet which should show up right there and you'll see some there's some other ones some other designs as well as uh crocheted plushies so check it out but if they buy do they get your actual hat you said they, you said they get this hat the hat they on your can head get well i'll give them something won't be you'll, give hat, so but, uh, you'll give them something. Be something. They're not going to get what they order. They're just going to get something. Why yeah. does that hat have? Why does that hat? Why does that hat have little something. yellow Jew curls oh, on the side? Whoa. It's, it's a fish. Yeah, yeah, it's it's, it's a fish eating. Those his look head. like those look like those fucking Jew curls, man. Jew dude. curls. Oh, yeah, oh, you yeah, know them Jews. The they have those little curls is on the front. Dude, he's a fucking he's a fucking Jew. He's talking about the the hair that Hasidic. We're all right. We're yeah, yeah, yeah. These Hasidic the Hasidic Jews, dude. The acidic Jew. Everyone here is a Jew except Paul. That's how they go. Yeah, I'm not a Jew. Fucking Paul. I'm Paul's a, a fucking fat Jew. I think Paul's German oh, or something. What? No, you're oh, not. Cool. Paul's part Jewish. I'm surrounded by Jews. Surrounded by the fucking Jewish podcast, Paul. What, what do you got? What, what, you know, Paul. What do you got against Jews? So many Jews. What do you got against us, Paul? What do you got against the Jewish uh, people? Nothing except for the fact that you're all penny pinchers and you control the media and Hollywood. Whatever, Nazi. That's a pretty fair point about the Jews. No, it's I'm not. just saying. It's offensive. I'm offended. I'm offended too. But it's still I'm gonna a fair sue Paul. Point. I'm going to sue you, Paul. Just it's offensive, but it's a fair point. What's wrong with uh, being cheap? I don't know. I, <laughs> I I don't. I've never really seen. I I grew up around some Jews, and I I never really saw evidence His of them family. being any more penny pinching than which makes Paul my family too. was. Yeah, I grew up in kind of a penny pincher family too. So you don't have to be Jew, I guess. Even though they had a pool. Yes. <laughs> well, that. How do you think they got a pool? They pinched pennies until they could afford a pool. I don't think so, Paul. I think your family My mom spent was living large. Forty-five years throwing pennies in a tiny what? little jar you know until what, she Paul? had a, a, enough to buy a well, pool. Well, your family was some welfare queens, Paul, living high on the hog. Yeah. Did Paul was swimming in his pool every day. Water? You, know what, you know what happened? Water. Thanks, Uncle Sucker. I fucking. I can tell you what happened with Paul's back. I, I think I know the real story, Paul. You dove in that pool a little too deep one day. Yeah. Injured your fucking back. Uh, yeah. I was roughhousing in my pool <laughs> like I did every day growing up <laughs> and uh, injured my back that way. That makes sense. I think Paul tried to jump in the pool before they filled it with water. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just really clean water. Water sparkly clear today. It was an expensive mistake. I tried to do a cannonball. <laughs> 
so beautiful. I'll tell you what, Paul can do a mean fucking cannonball. I, I that is do. true. That TJ's is. cannonball was dog shit in comparison. I developed one called the corkscrew. Yeah. In my older years, and uh, it. it <laughs> Cork it splashes. It splashes Not when you were a, a kid, though, right, Paul? No, I never, I never learned the corkscrew. We just did normal cannonballs when I was a kid. What a fag! In the pool that you had as a kid. In the pool that I had access to as a kid. Yes. <laughs> I had access. To yeah, I like how he words it. Are you? I, I don't know. Though on some occasions, I may have had some time of type of access to on certain days and times. Yeah, dude. Can I plead Sounds the like fifth, dude? Been. I plead the fifth. Yeah. Is that, does that mean you're not talking? That means I plead the fifth. That means to refuse this answer. Any uh, on, a, on the advice of my counsel, Egghead Prime. On the grounds of being incriminate him. Fizif. Yeah. Mr. Ego will not speak any further on this matter. Yeah. No, all information about the pool will be run through my, my spokesperson, Egghead Prime. Was it an in your counsel because I'm Jewish? Yeah. Egghead Prime Steen. Well, that makes sense. <laughs> Prime sting. <laughs> I can't argue with that one. See? That's why he's my fucking lawyer. He knows when to not argue. You gotta have inclusivity, you know, a woman. No, no, I, I, I'm not, I don't trust you. I don't trust you. <laughs> you don't trust yeah, you. actually, uh, we, just, we watched we watched the room today and it showed us never to trust a woman. Of don't, course not. Yeah, don't true. trust true, women. Yeah, dude, Lisa. Lisa, 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 Lisa I'll, I'll fucking trust Lisa. She was tearing him apart, dude. Lisa's a cunt. She was a big slut. He was he was so generous, dude. I mean, Johnny Johnny was a great guy until he killed himself. I mean, it's sad he's, he's dead, but you know, his, why his, his, the memory of Who him did he lives leave on. His money to? Denny, Denny, uh, Denny got the, all the money. You know that's true. I hope so. And then he went to open the restaurant. So, do you guys know how many atheists died during the rind of Zhao Zedong? What was it? Zhao Zhao Zedong. Zhao Zedong. That's twenty million, Paul. I can't even fuck it up as bad as he did. I think it was trillions. Million. Trillions, trillions of atheists. Of yeah, eight, eighty-eight trillions. trillion people. <laughs> eighty-eight <laughs> trillion people died under the rind of Zao Dadong, dude. <laughs> Zao Dadong. Zao Dadong. What a fucked up name that guy had. Why did he? Gentlemen. He almost tried to say it. He he almost seemed like he was trying to say it French at the end there. Zao Dadong. Zao Dadong. You have no Zao Dadong in your soul. Zero, Maybe his brain realized at the last second that he just said something that didn't exist, but he I was too lazy I, to re-record no. what he uh, done. Uh, He's too I, I wish. Stupid. Dude, the there's line. already a Zeo de Dong in the <laughs> chat. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> Zeo de Dong is already The rind of Zeo de Dong. Yeah, dude. The rise and fall of Zeo de Dong. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, uh, thank you guys, soapbox Thanks. patrons. Thank you, soap boxers. Soap Be sure to check out their hats and the Meds Peds channel. Yep. And put uh, some links down okay, there below. Okay, crochet and the Meds Peds. Go look them up. Yep. Link will be in the Discord for Discord people. Okay. There you go. And Discord. You know, I'll do that too. Yeah. Cool. The, so check out the DP Discord if you want to go meet those people for some reason or another. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and they're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Oh, yeah. thank now, God. now we can talk on this shit about them. terrible people. Banned. Terrible. Oh, jeez. Which one did you hate more? Oh, I, I hate them equally. Ah, oh, yeah. They were pretty. They were both pretty disgusting. I've always hated that smarmy weird, egghead too. Because because we've met them both in real life. Yeah. It's oh yeah, that's true. Yeah. I yeah. murdered in them Louisiana. both in real life. You murdered them. Yeah. You better count Whoa. your fingers if you shake hands with that egghead too. Yeah. Yeah. He's one of those, you know what I mean? You know, you mean Egghead times. Beta? I know what you're talking about. Egghead Prime. Oh, I mean. okay. Egghead Egg Prime. Head Sorry. Prime. Egghead Prime. Egghead Alpha, I think we decided to call him, actually. But yeah. Egghead Prime still sounds yeah. better. Egghead the Prime. Egghead Beta. Prime Egghead. I think you can use Prime or Alpha. As long as you... Big vaginas are my cup that he's of the greatest. Joe. <laughs> The greatest oh of the eggs. Dude, I was tired of Super Chat. The show's like 90% Super Chat now. Yeah, that's good. Hey, TJ's brother. Jesus, man. <laughs> Jesus, man. <laughs> Zayo de Dong is the best dong. Also, help yourself to some more of my money. Good. Cool, thank you. Good. Keep it coming, bitch. Welcome to the Super Chat Show with the Super peasants. Chat Show. With the Super Chat Show. Where we show. don't talk about anything important. We just take your money with the Super Chat. Super Chat. Yep. 
Oh, it's going to be sexy. Look at all these inferior non-super chats going on. Look by. at all these stupid people who think we're gonna, we can't, guess. We don't care about your fucking free no-pay chat, you bitch. I can't even read what it. It that, doesn't even look like English Paul, to me. What is it Pitmonk says? Feed, feed the clock or something? Uh, what pay the clock, oh, I think. Pay the clock. Hey, but it's time to pay the clock. Pitmonk been here 45 minutes. I ain't got no super chat. No, super so trying to play that clock. That Lou Capri's creepy singer in the wolf shirt used to come into my work in Illinois Whoa. and hit on teen girls and shill his music. That's awesome. <laughs> wow. that is That's exactly what I expect that yeah. guy to do. Congratulations Sounds to him. Sounds about right. That spider on the last episode was called a trap door spider. Imagine if you walked over its dirt hole and it jumped out and grabbed your foot, TJ. Yeah, All right, I'm, I'm imagining it now. Thanks. What would What would you do? What would I do? Would you immediately turn into a simpering bag of he weeping would. nonsense? Uh, yeah. Wow. I'd probably scream. Dude, imagine, and run. If you, imagine if you fell and the fucking spider like touched your face. I was like trying to eat no, you, dude. No. No. Ah! Fuck you, Scotty. Hi, Paul. I agree with the, both of those. Gargling blood. Gargling What's the like gargling blood, bitch? Blood. I had to pay six hundred dollars in car repairs today. Here's Wonderful. five dollars anyway. Paul can't have any of it, though. Good. Holy shit, dude. No problem. Paul, did you ever see The Sopranos? Uh, I, I, I saw a few episodes of it and got bored. You were, Oh, you're going to diss on wow. The Sopranos, yeah. huh, Paul? I, I never seen bored. it, honestly. I love the private show, and I couldn't stop laughing at the rind of Zayo de Dong. Give my money to Paul. No. So no. That'll make up for the $5 I don't get. We're taking the money. I'm Paul, fucked I'm up. Zero again. I'm fucked up, and this is the best show on earth. Thank you. I mean, those two sentences definitely belong Psychedelic together. Psychedelic fucks. Paul, Zayo de Dong <laughs> demands you put your dick on Pornhub. Well, it's smaller oh, installments coming from Mr. Naughty Priest now. He's running out of money. Well, you know <laughs> he's, he's I know he's running out of money. He's just not getting what he wants from Paul. He's gone into receivership trying to get this dick. Is reality determined or does free will exist? What a deep fucking question wow. for Drunken Peasant Super Chat. Well, yeah. I'm a Christian, so I believe free will exists. Free will is bullshit. Uh, well, how dare you say that, Paul? Yeah, I mean, I feel you like given free I feel like there's creator. a lot of semantics you have to untangle before you can even really address that question. I identify as a billionaire, and I think it's racist that I'm not treated like a televangelist with a private jet. I feel oppressed. Mm. Paul, a.k.a. Rush Limbaugh, is a straight, white, cis male. A.k.a. Rush so Limbaugh. So why can't he pay me? Hashtag racist Jew Paul. Whoa. Wow. Very valid point. Okay. Well, I don't know how to respond to that, so we'll move yeah. on. Got VIP I've tickets for me and my crazy. girlfriend. See you losers in Seattle. I'll bring the dorbs. See you here, bitch. It brings Sweet. the dorbs. I almost died an hour ago while watching the last show. I looked down while driving and looked up, and I was in the grass going 50. Then went airborne as I tried to get back on the road. Almost died watching yeah, you guys. Please don't die uh, watching yeah, our yeah, show. Yeah, don't die. Maybe wait till you get home to watch us. Hey, How's that? Th that reminds me. Everyone who's watching this show now, uh, if you you know, put us in your will as your the sole benefactors in your will. So if you do die, <laughs> yeah, we get all your money. That's a good idea. All your what money do you think of this season's Game of Thrones? Haven't only, watched one dun, episode. Dun, dun, there's, dun, there dun, is dun, only dun, one dun, episode. Dun, no, there's oh. two. Oh, there's two now? Dun, They're spreading. Dun, dun, dun. I haven't watched Game of Thrones in years. I like think four years. I, li I like the last two episodes. I haven't seen them. I think I did say half a one, TJ is like TJ's like way behind on Game of Thrones. Ever see the 90s episode of Politically Incorrect with Marilyn Manson yes. and oh, Lakeitha, yeah. Lakeitha yeah. Garth? Yeah, I have. I love that episode. That's fun. Make a channel named Obscure Right Wing Podcast and link it back to DP. Right Why should it? we? We're already it sounds like known. a waste of time. We're already the most well-known Obscure Right Wing Podcast in America. You guys should get Kyle Kalinske on the show again. Also, please clap. Please clap. We're going to do, do a movie on about Jeb. TJ. When Brett said Rhine, I think he was talking about the Rhine River in Germany. No, no, no. I think he was trying to say the word I, rain. Yeah, yeah. What, what would Mao have anything to do with the Rhine River? In I think Germany? he was trying to say the reign of Mao Zedong. The reign yeah. of Shao Mao. Dong. Tell my son Scott Minnis. Uh, that he needs to get a job and stop mooching off his mom. Yeah, fuck you know what? job. I'd be hypocritical to give that advice. Yeah, I can, a job I can like guarantee me. you that Wait Brett doesn't even know that there's a river in Germany called the Rhine. You're giving him too much credit, Scott. There. Maybe Scott, you're never gonna get any pussy if you don't if you live with your mom. Nobody that lives with their mom gets maybe laid. Maybe he's gay. It just doesn't work that way. You're not gonna get any nothing. You're not gonna you guys, get any boy pussy. You're gonna get nothing, dude. Do you guys think that, that Rudy Giuliani will replace Jeff Sessions as AG? Who gives a fuck? Doubtful. Doubt, doubt it, but maybe. Watch some angry MGTOW videos for crazy people. Also, there is no way to know if free will exists or not. The only thing that can be certain is that we don't know much. Good. 
Tell my girlfriend she's short and fat. You're short and fat. Zach Murphy's girlfriend, you're short and you're fat. Why? Zach Murphy's girlfriend. Why does he want? Have you Appar- heard the news? I mean, <laughs> why do you want people to insult fat? your girlfriend? Zach Murphy's ex-girlfriend, yeah, I should say. <laughs> soon to be ex-girlfriend. You're short and fat, according to him. Yeah, quit being short. Quit being fat. Zale quit being Zale. short. Oh, boy, that guy's got a fucked up name. You, 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 you think Kyle Kalinske is an SGW? Um, I really wouldn't put him in that camp. Yeah, neither would I, but maybe. I yeah, want my billion dollars, Paul. No. Uh, you, you're not going to get it. Yeah, but watch watch him come on our show and say one thing that might be considered SJW. Uh, yeah, big guy, give me uh, that. Snowflake yeah. alert. Snowflake alert. Snowflake alert. Buy stocks and bonds with this, you old fogies. Okay. I'm investing in pork bellies. Silver. Uh, S- silver's down a lot. I wouldn't yeah, invest sil- in silver. That's, silver that's why dropped. I'm invested. Yeah. It's going to go Buy right low, back sell to high, fuck Scotty. It, it could go up eventually. You know what, Paul? I don't think you're fucking right, buddy. It's a but silver has market. Market. I'm going to fucking... It's a buyer's Invest market against on you, silver. Paul. I'm, I'm buying I'm orange, taking out shares I'm get and Paul orange being juice, destroyed. Dude. Frozen orange juice. Oh, whatever, dude. You like in watch. trading places, yeah, dude. Say. Dude, I think we can do that. Isn't that legal on Wall Street? I can make a bet that your bet is wrong. And yeah. you can make a bet that yeah, my like, bet is wrong. Yeah, like options that your trading. Bet is wrong. Yeah, we could kind of do that. Yeah. yeah. Cool, let's do it. All right. Just infinite regressing bets until yeah. Yeah. Voila, we both win. Infinite regressive. <laughs> All, right. All right, so here's the news. The Wait, only really? news that matters, DP Action News. Woo! Uh, the st- stupidity. TJ. They are. Ha! You dumbass! Go to the polls. And you better well learn to love it. Uh, okay. I will do. I've learned to love it. So uh, apparently, all we got yet again is a bunch of Trump shit. Trump, that's Trump, Trump, every Trump, single Trump, fucking Trump, thing. That's not all Trump, we got, Trump. but there's you know there's it's a sprinkling a, of Trump. It's more Trump than it is anything else. So here we go. Jared Kushner releases statement. I did not collude. He's clearing it up for us. He's I letting us know what's collude. what. Right Could before he goes in to do sealed testimony. Where's that? Let's play it. Count um, as you get deeper into this um, mm-hmm. into this uh, uh, written, te- by Jared written, written testimony. Released. Yes, okay. there's an account of, of that matter. Um, he his version again. I'm going to summarize here, but his version is that in his meeting with Kislyak in December, um, a meeting that he claims Kislyak wanted, okay. asked for repeatedly. He did not. He says he didn't have time to schedule it for about a week. It finally got on the calendar. He went. They talked. Kislyak told him, mm-hmm. I believe I'm fairly representing this, that he wanted, he, Kislyak, had information from Russian generals about the situation in Syria that he wanted to convey to the incoming administration. Mm-hmm. And he, Kislyak, asked if there were a secure line into the transition that they could use in order to convey that information. K- Kushner and Wu Tang Clan, and you'll recall, uh, replied Wu-Tang to him, no, Clan? there was no such secure line. At which point, Kushner says, that he then asked, well, is there some secure line that you might have so we could have this conversation? He then claimed ah. Kislyak said no, and that was the end of the conversation. Again, wow. just... Re- dude, isn't this riveting? That's so fucking fascinating, isn't dude. Isn't Trump riveting, dude? God, I love this. Wow. Aren't you glad that uh. our news media is discussing the minutia of every tiny little fucking thing? I am Not so really. deeply, so 24 deeply hours invested. a day. so sick of this bullshit. No, Scotty. Seven days this a week. This is fucking... This is a sizzling hot story, it's dude. sizzling hot. Fresh oh, it's magic. Grill. I can't even stand how fucking legit this fucking news story is. Just breaking my mind well, with excitement. MSNBC, so what do you expect at this Breaking point? my fucking mind with exciting possibilities. See, I, I prefer the uh, Fox News version of bullshit. It's a lot more entertaining. Yeah. It is. Did, did you see how that one guy from Red Eye is now trying to be like Stephen Colbert, like the conservative Stephen Colbert? <laughs> all right. Yeah. That sounds... He's not funny That sounds at all. horrible. You, the Kushner version. Well, this, and of course, this just all came out in the past hour, so <clears throat> we're doing our best to get through it, but clearly Jared Kushner is looking to clear his name and move on. Uh, today, Kushner is expected to answer questions from staff of the Senate Intelligence Committee, as we mentioned, investigating Russia. The interview will be conducted behind... Be under oath. Doors and Kushner will not be under oath. Okay, what's the point? Yeah, what's then? the point of having him come in to testify so if nobody to gets lie. to hear his answers <laughs> except for the people in the room, and he's not even under oath? Um, I don't know. There's he's, no consequences look, for lying. He is cooperating fully, Paul. 
and wants to see the investigation June 2016, handled in an expedient 2016 manner. meeting at Trump Tower with Donald Trump Jr. and a Russian lawyer is expected to be at the top of the agenda. As we've been saying, just in this morning is a copy of his statement to congressional investigators. He's expected to say that Trump Jr. invited him to the meeting, but at that time he did not know who else would be there and didn't read the entire email. <laughs> the only concern about that is the subject line was pretty clear. The first word was Russia. The first word was Russia. So is he in the habit of just going to meetings that he doesn't know who's going to be there or what's happening at the I mean, meeting? Uh, let's be honest here. Everybody here has accidentally stumbled into a meeting with a Russian diplomat. Uh, I, mean, true. I mean, fair enough. The statement reads, quote, I... All right, I'm just going to read the statement because I don't want to hear this bitch say it. I arrived at the meeting a little late. When I got there, the person who has been since identified as a Russian attorney was talking about the a, the issue of a ban on U.S. adoptions of Russian <laughs> children. I had no idea why that topic was being raised and quickly determined that my time was not well spent at this meeting. Okay. So he went to the meeting. Bullshit. So it was a waste of the time. meeting that there were only four people at. Eight. I mean five. I mean six. I mean seven. seven I mean eight. eight. Oh, there was eight, actually. So he went there, and they're talking about Russian kids, and he's like, this is a waste of my fucking time. What am I even doing here at this dumbass meeting? That's basically the same thing Trump Jr. said so before they, he proved that it wasn't everyone, anything to do with that. Everyone just got the suckered emails. into this shitty I mean, meeting that no yeah. one cares about. If you about. believe what the, the, the emails and the subject of the, those emails, then you know this is really just, I mean, maybe this issue was brought up. It's, poten it's potentially true, but it's, that wasn't probably why they took this meeting. He didn't even read the emails, Scott. He just kind of like, he skimmed them. He's like, yeah, okay, meeting. You know, yeah, I love it's meetings. Like, it's like I'll the, go to any it's meeting. It's kind of like with reasonable doubt. It's like you can always have, there's always some doubt about what happened. Well, I, I didn't really read the email. I, I, I have so many meetings. I don't really remember what meeting this was, you know, you can always raise some sort of doubt about this. Arrived at the meeting a little late. When I got there, the person who has since been identified uh, as a Russian attorney was talking about the issue of a ban uh, on U.S. adoptions of Russian children. I had no idea why that topic was being raised and quickly determined gross. that my time was not well spent at this meeting. Uh -huh. I'm looking for an bounced. excuse to leave. Kushner says he emailed an assistant to call his cell. He claimed there were for, quote, 10 minutes or so and that he had never met with the Russian attorney before that meeting, nor has he spoken with her. Guys, I went to the meeting, but I was like, I you was know like, what? Oh, this man. meeting's mm. lame, brah. Mm. Gotta I gotta get, get the fuck up <laughs> out of here. I need to call me. Get me out of here. Could also face questions over transparency. We learned late Friday that his financial forms were revised to include almost uh -huh. 80 assets that were omitted in previous hey. disclosures. Kushner has also had... Kind of off topic, but not completely. How many of you guys knew that her and Joe were banging each other? Um, I didn't know. I knew about it when it was pub made public, oh, but I, I, I didn't I, know it before. I always kind of thought there was something going on there between giving each two. other the little yeah, DVD. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, to I could update his security clearance survives. forms several times to include previously undisclosed meetings with foreign nationals. He ex expected to tell. Is this bitch like ear splittingly loud in anyone else's fucking ear? Or is that just her? Or is, what is that? Uh, I don't know. Is She's fucking like clipping in my fucking headphones. Really? I don't know if that's happening to anyone else. Anyone else? No. I'll turn it. I can turn it down if it's too loud. Uh, I, I guess it's probably volume. fine. I don't know which one. I think I'm plugged into one of the ones oh, over the there. the congressional uh, panel quote, I did not collude, nor know of anyone else in the campaign who... All right, I don't give a fuck. Next. I did not. I did not collude. I'm I an, did not. Basically, I'm innocent. Okay, sure. Who knows? Anthony Scaramucci. 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 Exploding over the multitude of issues clouding his administration. It's -a me, Less than 24 hours after the stunning shakeup at the White House, the president ferociously unloading on Twitter his tirade about leaks, the Russia investigation, and the new bombshell report about Attorney General Jeff Sessions and the campaign. The new White House communications director digging in on his first full day, explaining why he's deleting his old tweets criticizing then candidate Trump. ABC's David Wright starts <laughs> us off. <laughs> Today, the president's flamboyant new communications director Thank you. sought to... Okay, he's flamboyant because he went... Thank you. Thank you. Fuck his off any and all harsh words he's had in the... How is he flamboyant? He's flamboyant. Man. If, okay, if Milo Yiannopoulos had got the job, yeah, then, you could, then you could yeah, use the word flamboyant. Yeah, he's flamboyant.
yeah. Scaramuccio. Passed about Mucho. his new boss, tweeting, full transparency, I'm deleting old tweets. Past views evolved and shouldn't be a distraction. Former man, Wall those Street past views evolved right as he got his job. I used to think Trump was a piece of shit until he hired me for this job, and now I think he's fucking that was awesome. great, dude. I love him. Of Anthony Scaramucci was already at pains to explain how in 2015 he called Donald Trump a hack. But that's another <laughs> hack politician. You call Donald pro- Trump a hack? He's a hack politician. Uh, he brings it up every 15 seconds, okay? <laughs> One of the biggest mistakes that I made because I was an unexperienced person. You didn't know he was going to be president, and you didn't think he was going to yeah, be president. Uh, look, in all fairness to me, I never knew he was actually going to get power, okay? I mean, come in on. In the world of politics, I was supporting another candidate. Today, Scaramucci scrubbed his Twitter account of anything even vaguely anti-Trump, deleting even some very old messages, praising Hillary Clinton as incredibly competent, sneering at a Trump campaign spectacle, and questioning Newt Gingrich's <laughs> judgment. Scaramucci isn't the only administration official to be haunted by his own words, preserved in the digital record. Is Today, this the, the Washington- dude that does the uh, the haunted house ride uh, at Disneyland? Ooh, <laughs> what the fuck was that? Why did that? Why was that so? Why did that sound uh, so fucking evil? Did all our news uh, is, is this is a fucking joke. It's just funny that this guy is. Th- this is not, this is what fucking matters in our country <laughs> is fucking who the communications director for the White House is. And Jerry Kushner had this meeting. That's that, that that's what is important to the American people. If it really is, and our country is just beyond fucked. It's not what's important to anyone. So Trump fired somebody and hired this old goat's nutsack. That's the shake. Yeah, up. wonderful. And Great. Post reports that U.S. intelligence agencies intercepted phone calls from the Russian ambassador yeah, that's the Russian that directly ambassador. contradict Attorney General Jeff Sessions' claim that he never met with the Russians on behalf of the Trump campaign. I never had meetings with Russian lie, operatives lie, 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 or lie, Russian lies. intermediaries about the Trump campaign. I did not have sex with that woman. Yeah. Politicians lie like crazy. Is anyone even fuck? It's like, what is this fucking story here? Politicians are lying sacks of shit. But you know, then they elect Trump. Trump is supposed to be the one that's going to fucking drain the swamp, and he's not a politician. You know what's funny? Is all this criticism about Trump, like, Trump is not a good politician. He ran as not being a good politician. He's like, I'm not like them. <laughs> and now they're mad he's not a fucking politician. Dude, what this is, is so fucking stupid, dude. What a fucking stupid country we live in with a bunch of fucking idiots. What if this, what if this is Trump's Trump. 4D chess, dude? What if he's draining D. the swamp by putting all these people in power so that they can be exposed for the Russia-loving pieces of shit this that they are? Then he gets exonerated, and then you know brings in the the people that are going to change everything ah, for the better. Did you guys, did you guys hear that Trump's going to crack down on weed? About fucking time. Is that Good. what he is that Finally. what he said? Yeah, let's take. We got a little. Yeah, there's a video right here. We let's can take a look at it. All right. The Trump administration is readying for a crackdown on marijuana users under Attorney General Jeff Sessions. President Trump's task force on crime reduction and public safety, led by Sessions, is expected to release a report next week that criminal justice reform advocates fear will link marijuana to violent crime and recommend tougher sentences for those caught growing, selling, and smoking the plant. Local law enforcement leaders say a crackdown appears to be next, though they argue there's no need for it. Eight states in the District of Columbia have legalized the recreational use of marijuana and another 21 states allow the use of medical marijuana, according to the Marijuana Policy Project, but marijuana use is still illegal under federal law. That's stupid. I can't wait for the crackdown. Yeah, it's like so we're much fun. Waste a bunch of money busting people, smoking pot. Hey, the private prison industry is lobbying for it, so it must be good. I, I mean, Jeff Sessions might not remain attorney general for very much longer, so... I don't think that's going to change Trump's agenda. Well, I mean, isn't the... Wasn't he the vector? Wasn't policy. Sessions the vector of all this anti-marijuana bullshit in the first place? Well, Trump has always kind of been... No one really knew where Trump stood. I mean, we know Trump is fine with medical marijuana... But now, obviously, there's going to be a crackdown on recreational marijuana. And, and, like, look, all the states it's really passed in are more liberal places. I mean, Alaska is probably the exception to that. But, I mean, we're talking about California, Oregon, Washington, D.C., that's liberal. Uh, where else is it? Massachusetts? Um, Massachusetts. Like Ver- Vermont or something? Or Maine or something? I don't like know. Maine, yeah. Well, Maine, not so much. So let's say uh, teens laugh at drowning man. I probably did. Move on, guys. <laughs> she did. Viewer discretion uh, is advised. D- have discretion, Get out viewers. the water! You gonna die! A blatant disregard for human life. We're not finna help your ass. 
You're finna, finna die, die in. You're finna a group die. Of teens taunt a drowning man yeah, while filming his final moments yeah. from afar. Ain't nobody finna help you, you dumb. Shouldn't have got in there. In the two minute long video clip, the five teen boys between the ages of 14 and 16 can be heard laughing as the man struggles to stay afloat in a pond in Cocoa, Florida. Rather than call for help, the teens recorded the incident on cell phone, chuckling while they watched the man die. They say this when the man <laughs> goes underwater and doesn't resurface. He just died. Bro, what, bro? Holy s***. <laughs> the state of Florida oh, he just does not died. have a law where Holy a citizen shit. is obligated to render aid for anyone in distress or call for help. Both Coco Police and the state attorney's office say they are frustrated that no one can be held accountable in this incident. We are deeply saddened and shocked at both the manner in which Mr. Dunn lost his life and the actions of the witnesses to this tragedy. We can I have, find I have no a solution. moral justification for either the behavior of the persons heard on the recording or the deliberate decision you know, you not know to should render do? aid to Mr. Dunn. Let's just put the, let's just put a file so one of these guys have a, like a health issue or some problem. Just don't want to help them. Just be like, ha ha! Actually, we can have people show up at their house and laugh at them as they're dying. Like, I'm dying! Ha <laughs> ha! That's funny! Uh, you dying! Bring on the fucking nukes. Police say the victim, 31-year-old Jamel Dunn, got into an argument with his mom and possibly his fiance the afternoon of July 9th. Ten minutes after the fight was over, police say Dunn scaled a fence surrounding a pond near his family's home and walked into the water. His family reported him missing three days later. The teens stayed quiet about what they saw, so police didn't know where to look. Dunn's body wasn't discovered until five days after his death. I feel like something should be done to them. The victim's sister posted the video of the drowning that? on Facebook. Yeah, why would you use that In a Facebook Live post, she questioned the teen's humanity. They could sit there and watch somebody die in front of their eyes. Well, imagine what they're going to do when they get older. What? Uh, imagine what they do that they don't do. It doesn't get much worse than watching a person who can't help themselves drown and laughing about it when they die. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. It's not much beyond that, honestly. Not much left. I mean, probably just, you know, stabbing people or whatever. That'd be better. Yeah, I mean, at least, at least there would have been some Atlantis. intention to that. They just kind of... I mean, it's just interesting how you can have some something like that where you just do nothing. It's like, huh, but I, I mean, even doing nothing, I can understand, like, you don't want to personally get involved. But the fact that they were laughing about it and just... It was like, it's funny you're dying. And filmed it and didn't call anybody. Yeah, I didn't do anything. Didn't do jack shit. Some fucked up people in the world. Ten dead in horrific human trafficking operation in San Antonio. Oh, beautiful San Antonio! Wow, like I'm, I almost, I'm almost missing watching Trump after all this shit. I see. see like, I told God. you there was more than just Trump. Yeah. You Look, see, this like, is what else is on the goddamn news. Can't stump the Trump. Can't stump the Trump. Federal prosecutors say James Bradley Jr. is the 60-year-old trucker who drove undocumented immigrants to a stifling end. Tonight, 10 are dead after San Antonio police found 39 of them, including teenagers, trapped in this tractor trailer. It, it's dangerous, you know, putting, you know, somebody's life at risk. These smugglers, they're, they're cattle. Dude, it's not as fuck in San Antonio Bradley right told now. investigators he was driving the truck from Iowa to Brownsville, Texas, but it stopped in Laredo to get it washed and detailed. He said he yeah, was whatever. unaware of the contents until he stopped at this Walmart parking lot Bullshit. to use the restroom. Bullshit. When he opened the back door, he said he was knocked to the ground by some of those who escaped. He said he then noticed bodies lying on the floor like meat. The gruesome scene... Yeah, he just had no idea what was in his uh, yeah. his truck Dude, until that point. Just, it just so happened I was part of a human trafficking hey, operation. Look, they put the trailer on it. What a doozy of the day. It. I had no... Fucking yeah, idea. He went out of Laredo. Bullshit. And I'm sure that that Saturday. little jaunt over to Laredo didn't include ah, picking look, up a bunch of illegal Paul, immigrants. <laughs> he, had to, he had to get his car <laughs> right on the his border. His tractor trailer nice and clean. Come on. Oh, you got, yeah, you got dude. a detail, dude. Got it detailed over and there. And Laredo just happens to be right near the border. Yeah, it's my favorite. You know, yeah, the, the, they always say get your truck detailed in a border town. You know, that's an old trucker thing. Authorities interviewed some of the survivors who said they started taking turns breathing from the only ventilation hole. Court documents say they paid smuggling and others linked to the Cetas drug cartel to help them cross into the U.S. One survivor from Mexico owed the smugglers $5,500. This dramatic police body camera video from 2015 in Texas shows the desperate conditions. Dozens of undocumented oh immigrants God. gasping for air, rescued just in time. A 
13-year-old boy among the survivors. And they're willing to risk their lives for their kids and for their family members. Last year, federal... They are packing that shit like sardines. Glad we saved you guys. Now get the fuck out of our country and go home. Dude, think about 39 people in a fucking tractor uh, trailer... Tractor trailer. Uh, no ventilation of any In kind. fucking San Antonio oh, with one vent. In summer. Yeah, no thanks. That's Fish fucking... Investigated. Yeah, that's... Well, insane. I mean, these people... These cartels treat this like a business. They don't, they don't look at these people like anything, but it's their value. It's like, you're paying us five or six grand, and that's it. They don't give a fuck if they live or die. They're getting their money. Yeah, that's true. They gotta pay up front. Uh, the, uh, although the dude said he owed them fifty five hundred dollars, so a lot of these, a lot of illegal immigrants are expected to pay out of their wages dude, when like, they get. Yeah, they're gonna be like serfs, dude. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, it's not very useful to you if they die on the way. Yeah, but so many of them are gonna make it. Uh, uh, the, the point I was gonna make is, imagine how many of these people just die just on a regular basis, and we never even hear about it. This is just the one that happens that we happen to hear about. Oh yeah, this happens more, all the time. Yeah than 2,000 cases of human trafficking. It's a symptom of a broken immigration system, which Congress, Congress has refused to fix. Don't waste your money. But Don't Homeland Security Denver. Secretary John Kelly well, says there's been a sharp drop in border arrests since February. And he argues the Trump administration's illegal immigration crackdown is a deterrent. Investigators say at one point nearly 100 people were crammed inside that track. Well, as soon as we build the wall, we can put an end to all this stuff. Why would, I would suspect there would be uh, less immigration to America from Mexico when you have someone like Trump in office. I mean, look what his rhetoric is. Of course people are not going to want to come here. Let's go live under that guy's rule. Sounds fun. <laughs> the wall. I mean, even when there's a wall, there's still going to be uh, trucks crossing the border. Constantly. Long, there's still going to be people overstaying visas, too. Yeah. So it's like, unless you just want to stop all traffic at the border, which is pretty much not feasible at all, there's going to be illegal immigration. Trailer tonight, at least 20 are still hospitalized. If convicted, the driver faces up to life in prison or even the death penalty. Hey, NBC News fans, Damn. thanks for checking yeah. out. But he didn't even know they were back there, you know? <laughs> oh, whatever, dude. He didn't even know. Microchip implant to buy things. The mark of the beast. Yeah, dude, it's, it's happening. It's here. The end is nigh. But your mom believes in this shit. Yeah, dude, it's happening. It's happening now. She's cool. She was talking about it she while called we were it. down there. All right, yeah. let's take a look. The deal is this, Julie. If you go into your employee break room at work, odds are you have vending machines to grab snacks or drinks. But a Wisconsin company called Three Square Market is trying to replace vending machines with micro markets. In other words, turning your break room into a mini convenience store with a self-checkout kiosk. So far, this company has about 20,000 of these things spread across the world. But here's the big story. The company is now the first in the U.S. to offer its employees microchip implants the size of maybe a grain of rice. It's implanted between your thumb and your forefinger, you know, in that skin right there. And once you get the implant, you can use it to pay for the stuff you buy in the micro market. Seems so unnecessary to me. I don't Dude, know. Easy peasy. Instead of scanning your iPhone or your phone, your smartphone, your credit card, you just you scan always your have hand. it on you, dude. Yep. Free Square Market says the program Unless is not mandatory, chops your hand but off. they do expect around 50 of their then employees you to get problems. the implants. And apparently, the chip can also be used to gain access to the building and to log into the company's computers. You, you know what, TJ? You'll never lose it. Dude, this is just the fr this is the front edge of this shit. And you know what? I for one welcome the new microchip transaction bullshit it, it simplifies my life i'm fine with it i'm not afraid of the technology yeah paul you know paul honestly what's going to happen is they're going to play in your brain and then you're just going to take over your mind eventually and then you know paul you don't have to worry about anything anymore it's just going to be someone's drone i think they'll have that little little uh cyanide release systems uh -huh. in the chip so that if you if they find out you're a dissident or something yeah, if they'll you're misbehaving like, oh excuse me i'll take you know, the risk they'll just and then you're just uh give me my microchip tabs on employees listen so if I'm one of your employees and I've got this chip in my hand, you won't know, hey, Josh is slacking off. I can tell because I'm reading this chip. No, there's no GPS tracking at all. Not yet. Yeah, experts say it won't it's be long coming. until microchips are used as passports, driver's licenses, even to pay for things like public transportation. The chips being used by three square markets. Mark of the beast. Yeah, can you it's hear? Happening, dude. Can you hear the dystopia already? You're Mark unchipped. of the beast. Unchipped piece of shit. No chip, no service. <laughs>
<laughs> it's going to happen, dude. Dramatic video shows Starbucks customer fighting off armed robber. Oh, was, this is pretty crazy what, shit. What, what, this is in Fresno? Yeah, this happened in Fresno, yeah. yeah. This is 58-year-old Craig Jerry enjoying his Starbucks order and working on an iPad at 5.30 Thursday evening at the Starbucks store on Golden State near Herndon and Highway 99 in Fresno. Suddenly, a man holding a yellow bag wearing an Optimus Prime Transformers mask flashes no. by and heads to the register. Jerry watches as the what? man threatens the clerk with a fake gun and eventually a buck knife demanding money. Police investigators say money. the man in the mask is 30-year-old Ryan Michael Flores. And what Flores doesn't realize is Craig Jerry has made up his mind. With a chair in hand, he plans to stop the Why are the there people attempt. just wiping down Jerry tables there? Jerry hits Flores from behind, and a fight ensues. Investigators say Jerry was stabbed in the neck during the struggle, but managed to wrestle away the knife and stab Flores several times. Jesus. Flores would flee the store and was later arrested by police. There's... Damn! Damn, dude. Probably not very many people in He's America his ass. that would do what Craig Jerry did last night. Yeah, I'd agree with that. That was incredibly heroic. So you're encouraging vigilante yeah. justice? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Uh, when it's against uh, a criminal, yes. Well, that's well, who the fuck else would it be against? A, a non-criminal. Dude, it's like you know what? It's like it, it's one thing about like the West that is kind of true. It's like, you know, play, uh, if dude, it was crazy if fuck Texas, behind him, dude. Say, they say the same shit. Oh, shit, Look at all crazy dude, eyes back there. These are the there. cops. These are uh, the Fresno PD. Usually cops would tell you not to get involved in... That's Jerry yeah, yeah, they're all like, he got some brass the balls chief, on that boy. That's one badass that ass some bitch. Most people would think that they would uh, respond, but may not have the courage to respond. This video is now making national headlines, and Jerry is being touted a hero locally and on social Ow. media. But Quit hitting me with that chair. Getting yeah, dude, he involved like this that guy. was risky, and it could have had tragic consequences. It's not something yeah, we he was trying to stab him. In this case, it was a good outcome. Um, no one died as a result of this incident, but um, he very well could have. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. He, he got could. stabbed in the fucking neck, so he very nearly died. Well, that's fun. Modular zombie. This cool. is fucking creepy, dude. Is it? The, we this this lab is way scarier than the microchip in the hand, dude. Let's take a look. Dun, dun, dun. Connecting brain with heart module. Whoa, cool. All right, so the, the heart starts beating. Then they plug in the lung, and it starts a breathing. And it's it's actual flesh. Yes. Cool. Adding the kidney module. Whoa. Neat. And then limbs, dude. It's oh, yes. alive. It moves. Whoa, dude, this is fucking neat. It's looks like something you shoot in a video game. Yeah, yeah. Dude, that's what I'm Half saying, Half-Life or something. Ah! Like, people are scared Kill of the wrong me. shit. Yeah, I know. Like, look at this fucking <laughs> thing we've created. End my miserable existence. Dude, that's fucking awesome. What a horrifying monster that we've created. Ah. Soon, Paul, they're gonna give I'm you that so kidney. I'm so proud of us. Soon they'll take over. Whatever. When your heart runs on one of those in ten years, yeah, you'll be happy. When, when some big, naughty, fleshy thing comes and busts down your door with one of those cool. modules, plugs in, into its head ten years from now, you'll... you'll uh, we'll see who's... You'll vision. remember this Someone conversation. Someone says this is fake. Yeah, we're seeing a bunch of fakes. It's not fake. We have no idea if it's true or not. It's real. I whatever, choose to believe dude. it. Snooty, world's oldest manatee in captivity, dies. Yep. Oh. Brett Keane's dad is dead, everyone. The king of the manatee has passed away. He was born in 1940. Wow. That's sad. Snooty spent most of his life Snooty in Manatee, Manatee County, County, Florida. Florida. Yeah. Too soon. Too soon. There he is. He liked to pose for pictures. I, I almost feel cool. like calling Brett a manatee is an insult to manatees. Yes. I kind of do, too, watching that. They Snooty feel, looks like a cool guy. Yeah. Well, they're so mellow. They're such mellow You know animals. what, guys? I think Brett's probably really broken up right now. Yeah, he's probably hurting pretty bad right I now. I mean, this look, the loss of the patriarch the of his king, family. The king of the manatees has passed away. The may, king of the manatees. May he eat his golden mac and cheese in manatee heaven. <laughs> yes. Wow. But it's, it's, that's definitely Brett, Dude, though. you know what, though? Fucking Snooty's got a better smile than Brett does. He does. More, <laughs> teeth. <laughs> more teeth. More friendly. Yeah. Snoot, look at Snooty, dude. Poor fucking Snooty. Dude, it was the dead. day after his birthday, 
And I know. Rest in peace, Snooty. He drowned. He didn't even die of natural causes. He got into some area of his tank that he wasn't supposed to be in and got lodged in it and couldn't get a breath and drowned. That's, that's so fucking Poor sad, Snooty. Dude. Snooty was awesome. Too bad. Damn, dude. The king of the manatees. R.I.P. Passed Snooty. away. Yeah. Snooty was. See cool. you in heaven, Snooty. Snooty. Yeah. May the rind of Zao de Dong protect him <laughs> as he moves into the next life. Eat, eat your glorious mac and cheese. Oh yeah. Yes, the fields of golden mac and cheese <laughs> away. Mac and cheese. <laughs> well, that's all the news we got. So get ready for some crazy fucking people. Crazy people. Oh, you, you guys know what we need to do? What? What? I'll wait till after this. <laughs> Crazy people. At some point, we need to do the mail. Oh, yeah. yeah. We got mail. But we can do it after this, I guess. We've That's got fine. mail. You've got mail. We've got mail. Girlfriend goes crazy at pizza joint. Neato. Oh, he's breaking up with her or something. Yeah, don't you do that, buddy. He's all trying to be like, hey, okay, it's okay. Yes, he's, eat your pizza. What you call me? Oh, shit, dude. She ain't taking this fucking sitting down. Dude, he's getting bounced on in this fucking... Oh. Oh, domestic violence. Yeah, dude. Yep. You peek. You peek. What? What a psycho. Man. Okay, now, you <laughs> these know guys what? are pleased as punch to have oh, yeah. witnessed that shit. But you know what? L okay, now l l l l imagine if that was reversed. Yeah, I I I'm so I'm so sure that they would everyone would react the same. Oh, ha -ha, <laughs> yeah. Funny fucking times. bitch! I'm gonna fucking jump this on you. Hey, buddy, what's going on here? Oh yeah, dude, there would be a white knight. There. Oh, there'd be like five white knights. Kick your ass, buddy! Learn how to treat a lady. <laughs> Maybe she'll let me into her pussy after she gets done with you, because she sees how fucking protective I am. <laughs> Dealership meltdown. Dealership meltdown. Yeah, awesome. Oh, yeah. You never stop shit! Hey, Mark! 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 They found, he found out they didn't have the model. I didn't know, I didn't know anyone filmed this. I don't even know what's going on. This is horrible camera work. They're they're far away. Right now, you can't even see what the fuck's going on. Something's in front of it. Yeah, step up closer. Landscape mode, motherfucker. Yeah, why don't they flip the camera, dude? Please. You'll, you'll be getting a ride here in just a sec. You won't even need <laughs> I've got your knees! Yeah, you're gonna get a ride. I'm you! Take your fucking clothes off, bitches! Whoa. Where's my bitches at? <laughs> <laughs> what is this guy's problem? Yeah. Give me my bitch. Dude, he thinks this is a strip club. Maybe this used to be a strip club and got bought. He's like, oh. where are my bitches at? I'm just here in a few minutes. Hey, everybody back off. Everybody back off. Back away. Where's my bitch? On your belly. Oh, my keys. On your belly. Okay. No, I'll take my fucking pants off. Dude, I'll take my. You take your pants huh? off. Whoa. He's gonna take his fucking pants off. On your belly. Now. Guys, like I want to see these pants off. Ah! Oh, I was getting tased. They're shocking you because you're fucking that, freaking that, out. That motherfucker's ass is hanging out. Yeah, dude, he's bare ass. I'm taking it. Oh, oh. oh no! Oh, dude, is his wang out? So this, yeah, yeah this has to either be mental illness or drugs. Maybe I, both. I, I, yeah, maybe a little skosh of both. <laughs> I mean, why do you go to? I mean, it's so bizarre. I mean, I understand like people that go to like McDonald's and do this because like it's just like that's where people kind of do this shit. They go like to restaurants or places where you go in your everyday life. Like, 
Why do you go to your a car dealership in your everyday life? I don't really understand that. Dude, if I were there browsing for a car, I would ask for a discount on a car for my trouble. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. You probably get it. You probably would. This All is right, fucking... everyone who, who saw the crazy naked man <laughs> gets a $200 discount. There you go. Okay. All right. Do you want to do the mail and then we'll come back to this? Sure. Yeah, let's do some all fucking right. mail. All right. How, how, how's uh, this if we, run? If we can switch the camera over there, there's all, all the mail is over there. Oh, or, over there. Yeah, it's all on the couch. Yeah, shit. do we have a couch cam? Or that? Uh, no, it's dead. Is it dead? It, oh, shit. Yeah, it's like not working. Let me see. I thought, I thought the monitor wasn't working, not the... Um, I think the cameras... Oh, the cameras. The cameras I think it was unplugged at some point. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, well, I so guess it's probably better to do it over here. Okay. Uh, I guess Paul's going to... Be the courier today. Get it. Get it. Get her done. Someone made something really cool for Paul. This. Yeah, let's show this off. This is something that someone sent to Paul. Yep. This is made entirely of uh, little beads. Yep, so this is Paul's, obviously. This is Paul's new Coolsville piece. He, he left it here well, so he could show it on the show, but I'm sure he's going to be taking it home and putting it up because this is pretty fucking neat. It shows a little uh, process on the back as to uh, how it was made. Very interesting. Shows the the process. I, I think this is the same person that made the Gurgi one too. Yeah, probably so. But very cool. And I'm I sure Paul's going to be. I don't know 100 percent for sure, but it does look cool. Yeah, oh, that definitely took a lot of time. All right, we have here uh, a box. Oh, and by the way, if you guys want to send us stuff, Drunken Peasants 227, Bellevue Way, Northeast, number 80, Bellevue, Washington. This looks like we got zero zero four. Some some DVDs DVD here. Fucking oh. D's. This is, uh, we got some classics. Samurai Cop. Fuck yeah, dude. Jesus. Greatest film. Cop, cop. In Blu-ray, too. We got a God's Not Dead and God's Not Dead God's Not two. Dead, he is surely a lie. Two films for the price of one. Wow, wow what a deal. Uh, Pulse, which I remember watching as a kid, but I have no idea what the fuck is it's about. Is that the story of the nightclub shooting? Nah, dude. This is an 80s cheese horror movie. I forget what the fuck it's about, though. Do you remember what this is about, Paul? Pulse? Uh, pulse. Like a, some radio pulse or some I thought it was like some kind of weird electrical demons or something. And Labyrinth. Labyrinth cool. is awesome. Yeah. This is a uh, collector's edition Jim Henson, of motherfuckers. Labyrinth. And also uh, some fake cockroaches. Even better. There you go. Fake roaches. Now, get the Trump dough. This is, uh, I already posted this on social media a little well, I'll bit. I'll show it on the show. But this is the Trump dildo. The Trump dough, dude. Believe me, I know dildos, and this is the best dildo. Let me you won't grab you by your You won't come any pussy. faster on any dildo than this one, guaranteed. <laughs> oh, it's a magic one. It's a good dildo. It's not a good dildo. It's, it's, it's the, the greatest. Best. It's the best it dildo. It is the best dildo. This is a, a sign... Someone sent us. Hibbity hoppity, get off my property. It's kind of cute. A little kitschy. Get off TJ's property. Get off my fucking property, get bitch. Get off my lawn, you kids. Get off my lawn, you darn kids. Get the fuck off my lawn. Hibbity hoppity, get off my property, yo. Oh. Uh, no. This is some kind of note. Yeah. It's a fucking note, dude. Dear peasants, I wish you a Merry Xmas in July. Hope you enjoy my homemade cookies with their legal tobacco situation. Oh, oh to the freaking Mally. Sweet. What if he put arsenic <laughs> in those cookies? I mean, what? You eat food that people send us all the fucking time, and now all of a sudden you'll be like, yeah. Okay, so the next time they, say, they send Oreos, we'll be like, TJ, those Oreos could be poison. They probably put... Uh, we want to save your life, so we're not going to allow you to eat them. They probably put antifreeze in these cookies, well, for all we know. Antifreeze cookies, dude. Antifreeze yeah. is odorless, Why don't you Paul. eat one then, Paul? You're the odorless. guinea pig. The Paul's the guinea pig to see if we die. Yeah, Paul. If you're not, if you're alive in 24 hours, I'll eat a cookie. He's the royal taste. Oh, dude, Paul's starting to cough right now. Oh, my God, there's blood pouring out He's spitting out up mouth. blood. He's spitting up blood. Paul's dead. Oh, he's a dead man. I think you guys should include a segment or maybe make a separate show where you discuss deep philosophical questions. Nah, like, we're too stupid. I don't want to do that. Plus, None I mean, of us want to do that. I guess these are we're dumb. Um, we're dumb. flags or something. Cool. And I'm proud to be. Uh, why don't you unfurl those flags? All right, let's see what this. Flag see is if going. there's a, if they're flags or if they're something out. else. 
This is proud to be on heroin because it feels so good to me. Is it a backdrop for us? <laughs> it is. Um, what the fuck is this? To step oh, on it's a, snake. it's a snake, dude. Check it out. Oh, it's like a parody of it. That's awesome. That should be hanging behind us. No step on snack. No step on snack. No step on snack. snack. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. Yeah, maybe bitch. I'll hang those up. We'll hang get it a up. Yeah, bitch. Hang that shit up. Hang them high, boy. Oh, is it the Kekistani flag? Yeah. Is that a, there's a little Kekistani flag? That's a big one, dude. We gotta put these behind Paul because he loves yes. Kekistan so much. Kek, here you go. You have no veto here, yeah, Paul. No veto. You have no veto here, Paul. Yeah. Kek, 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 kek. All right, she so does put it behind us, so it's it's still in Paul's kek. shot. Fail frogs. I'm wearing this the rest of the show. It's so beautiful. You should. So fucking beautiful. And someone sent Paul a someone, bunch someone of Someone sent a bunch of DVDs. There's first of all, there's a little championship yes! belt. Not the a US championship. Alright, so let's see what we got here. Yep. Uh we got Jesus. Jesus. This is a uh, this is Jesus, a movie about a Mexican Jesus. gardener. Cool. Interesting. What? It is. About a, uh, fucking oh, there's some kind of note gardener. down here too. I guess I'll read that first before I show it off. Here is Paul. I hate Greetings. You. I am the guy who was in the kilt at the Mastodon concert. Sorry for running out, but had a bad case of starstruck. I have a bad case of diarrhea. Uh, here are some movies for your channel, Paul. Scotty, we all know the real champion of 1998, so here is a belt. Also, did you watch Starship Troopers 2 and 3? Gotta ben, wear the awesome. belt, Scotty. TJ, you are just mad, but stay neat as well it's as for classy. like little kids. It's many an arm belt. Many yeah. thanks, anti anti. P.S. Sorry for the caps. I have shitty lowercase written. Whatever. They said. Uh, they said I'm only mediocre, so I'm taking their DVD collection that was intended well, for Paul. I believe it's for Paul. Uh, what DVDs are in there? Uh, there's, as I said, Jesus, Tale of a Mexican Gardener. We can just read them. You don't have to show them all. I'll show them all. All right, fine. Wagons East. Okay. Wow, that's John Candy's last movie. Oh yeah, it's true, isn't it? Uh, Zardoz, right here. Motherfucker Zardoz, Sean Dark Connery, Mark Ajalon. I like that one. This is a this is a, a great underrated film, the Super Mario Brothers movie. It's a blast. It's beautiful. Ugh. This is a creepy looking live action version of Pinocchio. Oh, dude, I remember that one. That's fucking weird, dude. Sweet. Uh, the classic Magic Mike. Of course, everyone loves Paul's that. Paul's gonna watch that at first, of course. Yeah. Uh, Affleck was the bomb in Phantoms, yo. The Phantoms. Short Circuit. That's a great movie. Damn yeah, it. Like I'm ups it's upside down. Short Circuit right there. That's a great movie. You also got Short Circuit fucking 2 in here, bitch. That's beautiful. Fuck yeah, dude. You were just singing a song from Short Circuit 2 the other day. Yeah, Paul. I was, wasn't I? Is, yeah. Is Steve Gutenberg in those movies? He's in the first He's one. In the first okay. one. Uh, an American Tale. No Cats in America. That's, that's, a, good, a, good, no that's a good movie. No Cats in America. Superman Returns. Phenomenon, which is kind of underrated, I feel like. At least if I remember so, it correctly. Wow, Steven, the Cell. This was produced by Steven Spielberg. And an the uh, the yeah. film version of Lost in Space. Terrible movie. I don't know why they felt the need to give you so many shitty movies. I think people like to see to me watch movies. shitty movies. Well, you know what? That's a lot of movies for Paul to watch. I've always, I've always liked Don Bluth films. Yeah, he's good. Yep. I think I'll start a series on the channel called Movies from the Box. And movies I'll just start from, from the, box. the Box. I'll just like reach into a box of shit that I have and pull out yeah, a movie. We should fucking do a commentary it. for Super Mario Brothers movie because that's a really ah. fucking bad movie. I remember seeing that in the theater. Me too. And I like, tried to being watch all it in excited theaters. and being like, "What the fuck is this?" <laughs> that was Mario. So yeah. By the way, I ate one of those cookies. So I know save, there was a, save that note there was for a, a handwriting I sample was a, if I die. A few other packages. Okay. At least one. There was one weird one. There was. Oh, that was the that was Paul's um the f Paul face. Yeah, that was oh, the giant okay. Paul face. Cool. So that's I think it. that's it. But, All right, uh, that's everything then. You guys want to send us more shit? Uh, so uh, as you've the, got uh, the address just, right there, where is it? P.O. Box. Yeah, here it is. It's Drunk also in the peasants, description. Two two seven Bellevue Way Northeast, number eighty Bellevue, Washington nine eight zero zero four. There you go. Cool. And we shall return with more crazy.
I don't think we're. People. Oh, we're not, we're not going nowhere. Oh, we're not. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, no, now we don't get to take a break. Now that TJ. Uh, I mean, not I guess smoking. we can if you want. Oh no. I, well, you guys said we were doing a, a break, but we don't have to. That's fine. Okay. Doing a what? Either oh, way. Oh, a break. Oh yeah, she, yeah. She doesn't care about breaks now. That yeah. He has, uh, but that's fine. We can keep going. I mean, I don't care. I'm what? good. I don't I'm good smoke, either way. I don't smoke yeah. anymore. Now it doesn't serve my purpose. No one gets a break. Take a break if you want. I don't give a no. shit. Whatever, motherfucker. Whatever. No, we. I, I was just. That's what you guys said. So I, I never said going. shit. He says shit all the time. He said all sorts of shit. I ain't never said shit, bitch. Well, I, I, I would feel, say TJ. then we can go to the chat for a little bit. We normally do that before we all take right. a break, and then we'll just continue with hey, the video. Hey, chat. What's going on? What is happening? Shit on the floor. Chat. Take a shit on the floor. Yeah. Everybody. Take a poopy on the floor. I'm going to see if I can find something to hang up this Kekistani flag with. Behind Paul? Don't put it behind me if you want it well, to stay up. What do you have up. against the Kekistani flag, Paul? I'm, Beca I'm, I'm dude, it's, it's a stagnant pond filled with frog retards. Look, Paul, people have a it's right a to express. It's a dead meme. They have a right it's to express themselves. It's not funny. It wasn't even really all that funny look, when it was Paul, new, and that, it's certainly your, not look, new. Look, look, Paul, you have a right to your opinion, but don't they have a right to express themselves? Don't you believe oh, in free absolutely, expression, they Paul? do. They've got they've free got a expression, total right. Free expression, Paul. <laughs> Kekistanis, dude. The Kekistani fly. Frog losers. Ugh. She's just proud to hang that flag up. You should be ashamed of yourself, TJ. You should be no, ashamed not. of that Kekistani No, bullshit. he is not ashamed, Paul. TJ is someone that supports freedom of speech and free expression, something values that you clearly do not possess. Yep. You remember I told You're that story support. when I was a kid and I buried all those fucking frogs? Yeah. I left one part out. It's just because I hated fucking frogs. Well, you know what, Paul? It's really sad. I'm sick of I'm these sad. fucking frog-worshipping pieces of I'm shit. I'm sad, Paul. I'm sad, dude, that you would have gone to those depths, man. Fuck them all. Someone else has to read the super chat since TJ's up. If the peasants become pirates, their ship will be called the Flying Manatee. Ride on, my young stewards, and the current of your destiny is forming. Sweet. Thank you. You should start. To, you should start uh, oh, you should just start referring to Brett as Justin's brother. Okay. That's, that's a decent idea. Nice try, Justin's brother. Justin's brother. <laughs> and Jimmy Jackson just gave us nothing to say, just money. Cents. Oh, here's condescending Goomba. Oh, Oops. Shit. Was the audio loud because you're smoking with... Ah, whatever. Ah, ah, get man, out of here, condescending A nice refreshing Goomba. smoke Thanks, would be great. Right Money now. wisely spent. It was not until the moon setting that I shatted on the floor. Great. Hi, Paul. Hashtag ban Sam. Oh, okay. it's Sam, dude. Thanks for calling me short and fat. You guys are awesome. That's Zach's, well, Zach Murphy's girlfriend. You're welcome. Hey, Legit. whatever. Most women don't like to be called fat. Spending my 21st birthday watching DP. Have some birthday money. Sweet. Cool. Neato. Ben Pie, that stream you did last night made me have to clean my keyboard for I don't know an what hour. you're talking Scotty, about. Scotty, when were you... Scotty, when you were happy to see me, I was the happiest puppo. Gross. I, I don't... Really uplifting news segment tonight, guys. Keep up the good show. Thanks. Yeah, I, I felt uplifted by it. The I, world is a, a, a wonderful, bright place filled with funny this things. This is because I'm happy you quit smoking, ah, TJ. Gross. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see how long that lasts. We Bring should... on the nukes situation. Bring on. I agree. So, Bring them on. Bring them on. Bring on the nukes. K. James. $5. Five dollars. Canadian Five. dollars. Ugh. If somebody tied you to a pole and forced you to watch every Tommy Sotomayor video ever made, how long before uh, you go mentally in instantly. insane? Instantly. Yeah, instantaneously. We were crazy even when we watched that other... We just had to do that special episode Hey, with guys. Him. Isn't Selena Gomez hot? Seriously, thanks for the great content. Uh, I, I don't yeah. know. I guess she's all right. I think she is. <clears throat> I can't believe the Kaiser died. R.I.P. in P's. 1948 to 2017. Also, this money is to go to none of you. All right. All right, cool. All right. We'll um, burn it. We'll it give it to the to manatee. Us. Paul is a normie, and he's a Jew, too, apparently. A Jewish in normie. Secret what? What? Paul is an Dude, I'm the only one here that doesn't, that can't, that 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 can't, that can deny Jewish heritage, so, right? Please check uh, out no, that video. Well, I sent we don't know what you, we don't know what your heritage yeah, is. So I, I have sent plausible the Facebook deniability. Page you guys are all. This guy sent an arrested yeah. who goes full living man on the cop. It's hysterical. Well, that sounds interesting. Well, maybe that'll be played next time or tonight. We don't know. Gas the gays. Gas the gays. Whoa. Gas them. Like Thursday Lane Dear style. Peasants, please tell my beloved brother Andrew to quit drugs. 
and devote his life to Mormon Jesus. Andrew, you know what's right. Quit drugs. Yeah. Stop it. Stop, Mormon stop, Jesus. stop those drugs, Andrew. No more it's drugs. No good for you. Y- get off the drugs, stop Andrew. It, Andrew. You're stop Andrew. You're throwing it. your life away, Andrew. Paul. If you can afford to be a racist trap with a swimming pool <laughs> filled with blood coming out of your ass, you can afford to pay me $2 billion. If you don't pay me, you're a racist. Wow. I th- I, Corbin has a good what? point here. I have, that, that seems uh, legit. I'll hear f- further arguments from Corbin on this. Only for through super Only chat. Through, though, well, yeah, of obviously. Cause I'm not hey guys, else. since we're shitting on our significant other earlier, would you guys say Alyssa has a boner for her Xbox and Destiny? Jesus no, Christ. I'm not saying that. That's dumb. You just did. We'll though, say, kinda. yeah, I guess. We'll say that she's on drugs. She's on drugs and she has AIDS. And, she and I hope she gives them to you. She needs to find Mormon Jesus. Trying to send you a Joseph T-shirt Smith. design of ribeye beef jerky. Finally finished the 24-hour special. You assholes well, are my TV. Uh, Love it. Facebook page. When I was little, I borrowed my neighbor's cat for a week and kept it in my room. He was really cute, but he was discovered. Oh, all Sorry. right. Cat napping. Cool. Hashtag free Kekistan. Free, free Kekistan, my Kekistani free Kekistan. brother. Free Kekistan. My beautiful Kekistani brother. Hey, Paul. Hey, Paul. Large hey, Marge. Large Marge. How are you doing? Scotty, it's Creamsicle. You were happy to see me. I, I Sad was. face. I don't think. I don't oh remember. God. Don't be coy, Scotty. Thoughts on Batman the Love Animated it. Series. That's an Beautiful. awesome show. Beautiful. Yes. Probably the best incarnation of Batman, in my opinion. Whatever. Love you guys. Plans for episode 400. No none plans. None of your business. Paul is not a real cynic. Yes, he is. I mean, he seems cynical enough. Can I <laughs> hump your bump, gump, and rump till you dump, cump? Yes. Do that. Okay. Sure. Paul, I'll post my dick on Pornhub and say it's no, yours. Go ahead. Cool. For go for it. For five bucks. There you go. I just heard some guys at work talk about wrestling, so I asked if they remembered way back in 98 when The Undertaker threw mankind off the Hell in a Cell into the Spanish announcement okay, table. Okay, what did they say? You're yeah. not, don't leave us in yeah, suspense. Yeah, what happened after that? you got to tell us what they said. Did they remember it? Deception and betrayed. betrayed. Deception, betrayal. Yeah, well, you know what? I've never deceived anyone or betrayed anybody. <clears throat> I think TJ has, though. TJ fucking betrays everyone Only eight here. people. I've only, I've only betrayed eight TJ people. TJ the betrayer. Paul betrayed us. He told us he didn't have a pool, but he had a fucking luxurious pool. He had seven pool. pools. Dude, Paul... Seven Paul, different Paul's pools, you're right. Paul's pool had a fucking grotto built into it and shit, dude. Yeah, and a water, yep. There was Oops. a water slide. And if was, you swim into the grotto, there's an indoor pool yeah, in the you, grotto. Did, did you service? get that yeah. thing... Did you get that thing I sent you? Who are you? Uh, yeah, we got, we got it. did you send me? Aggressively passive, we got it. We got dude. it, dog. We got it. We got you're it. the dude that sent the weed cookies. I ate them. Join me for a re give money to Paul. No. Since you won't pay me my $3 billion, I will raise an army of dead cats filled with the blood of the demons you worship, and they will cuck you. Whoa, dude, they're gonna cuck fucking us? Damn. Whoa. So, dead cats filled with demons' blood that have been reanimated will cuck Paul? Oh, yeah. I get it. Yeah, they're gonna cuck Paul. That's some deep shit, dude. Makes so- makes sorry, perfect Paul. fucking sense to me. Uh, Unless you gotta give this guy $3 billion, you're getting cucked, dude. You're going to the cuck tent. I'll, I'll need to hear... Th- further from him on this. You need to know more? Yeah. Paul needs to know more. Would you like to know more? <laughs> and remember, the more money you send Paul, the more the money Paul has to send to you. Is, yeah. yeah if you send Paul $3 billion, I mean, he might be able to afford to send you $3 billion back. Yeah, that is true. In fact, if you send me $3 billion, I'll guarantee I'll send you $1 billion immediately. Wow! How generous. That is pretty generous. <laughs> I mean, look, dude, I'm, I'm a fucking I'm you a gregarious guy. You fools failed to get the Harvey Birdman reference. We're sorry. Oh, are you reading Grey Chat? Why are you doing that? I don't know. That's it like, just caught my eye. It's like slamming your dick in the car door. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. Well, he does have a pretty small dick. Have so. a dart, TJ. Okay. Tell me I'm pretty. You I'm, look, I'm you look pretty. pretty pretty. I'm pretty. Is she the the witch from Snow White? Uh, Not from Snow... No, she's or, like uh, Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty, dude. Sleeping Beauty, but with sunglasses, so therefore it's Caleficent now. Isn't Sleeping Beauty the hot one in that movie, though? I mean, I guess if you're into that vanilla shit. You'd rather you'd rather tap up Maleficent? Yeah, dude. Who wouldn't? Me. You're a weird fellow, Well, you Paul. know what, Paul? I mean, can't talk much about I your I mean, taste, Sleeping dude. Beauty would be a little boring in the sack, but... How do you know? She's asleep. 
She's not asleep so the whole you'd, movie. You'd probably be more. She, into, would, be, she would be during my sex scene. <laughs> you, uh, Whoa. So, so what's your stance between Ursula and Ariel then? Ooh, Paul? well that's a little different though. That's a little different because Ursula's got the, Ursula the is meat. thick in all the right places, and she's got <laughs> tentacles. You know, yeah, and that that's that, got to off. That's got to open up some new possibilities. Oh hell yeah, right? dude! I, I forgot you and Paul under tentacle porn. So I, I yeah. guess Ursula would probably work better for you. I'm guys. not really into tentacle porn, but yeah. if I'd let Ursula oh, no, fuck oh, no, with Paul, my dick with her your, tentacles. Your downloads folder says dick. Friend, dude. Would you uh, uh, maybe. <laughs> would you let her put a tentacle in your bum? In your bum, uh, bum, Paul. I mean, like, in your I, bum. I, get, I mean, I don't know, dude. Maybe just for that split second yeah. before you you shoot. Yeah, yeah. You know, not, nec- not necessarily. She's not necessarily fucking you with it. She just kind of sticks it up there just as you come to give you that little oh, extra. A little, there a you little go. extra. Yeah, a little I'm extra oomph. Oh, you know? uh, okay. Well, you know, it is Ursula, so I mean, whatever. As a biology major, I know thousands of species of plants and animals. Look, I know Thus plants. far, I'm not sure what bread is. You guys may have discovered something. Wow. Uh, I feel special. All right. Well, let us know if he's a new species and we'll name it. Uh, Paul is confirmed an SJW cuck for not liking I, Kekistan. I Hashtag free Kekistan! Oh my god. So lame. Paul wow. date rapist confirmed. confirmed. Shocking. You know how many you know how many videos I pass that's all this like fake Kekistani news that these stupid frog fucks make for themselves that they try and pass off as real? You just don't understand Ugh. the Kekistani you people, dude. You don't understand where they're coming from, Paul. Don't be racist Paul against They like Kekistani. to fantasize that they've been mentioned in the news and shit. <laughs> so you they know, make Paul. news stories that aren't real about themselves. Oh, uh, well, you Fake know. news. That's beautiful, Paul. They're just trying to have first. That's fun, just Paul. as valid it's as the real trying news. They're just trying to have some fun, Paul. And Paul doesn't see the humor in their fun. It's sad. Girls just want to have fun, Paul. Frogs just want to be free, dude. Well. Monster moth freak out. Yeah. Monster Moth. Guy freaks out, screams like a woman. It's cool. A big fucking. You don't have it. Do There's you? a fucking yeah. moth. Holy shit. Holy, Holy shit. Holy motherfucker. Look at that. That's a fucking Mexican butterfly. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it is big. Oh my Jesus. Look at the size of that fucking thing. Where do I take it? I get it the fuck out of here. Take That's it outside. Like a bat. It's like a bat. It's like a Take bat. It to the Have you ever seen a bat? Oh yeah, I mean, I guess not, there are little fruit yeah. bats. Yeah, there's that bats size. that small. Dude, but, there's not, but a bat is just different. They're bigger. I don't understand than that. being than scared that. of a little moth. Yeah, moths don't even have like stingers or mouths to yeah, bite with. N- there's literally nothing that can moth bite. can do. I think they can bite. Yeah, yeah I, I think Ben's right. I do think M- they moths can, can bite? Yeah, because uh, they don't used they to just make, have a proboscis. Hold on, they they used to make chests to 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 hold linens in out of cedar because it repels moths. So that's well, why. Well, yeah, they, no, mothballs. Right. It, and it repels moths because they would. Because they eat fabric. Big. Right. Yeah. You have to have a mouth. They're not, they're, they're not going to bite you, though. Moth. I've never been bitten by a moth. I was just saying that they had a mouth. Moth bites. Yeah. I guess if you're a silk chamisee or whatever the fuck, they're, they're pretty dangerous the animals. <laughs> I don't they're know. Not. Isn't that something some bitches wrap around themselves when it's cold, but not cold enough to justify a jacket? Wow, bitch, I don't know. Bitches, Paul. You're such a fucking. <laughs> Such a some shit, mis- bitches. A you. misogynist, Paul. Holy shit! This is a fucking butterfly, or a God. moth, or some shit. It's a moth. It's as big as take a bird. It, take it outside ah, if you're worried. Fuck. Get it away from me! Open the door. I get, move over to there, and I'll open. Oh, the move door. over. But that fucking thing is freaking. It's me not gonna do anything to you, dude. This guy's a that giant pussy. Thing, I know. Flight, I am gonna shit my pants. Cool. Get Let's see it. This is what our country here, is now. Fucking... That oh no, a moth! Does that have a hornet or anything? Go on, moth. Oh, what a what a. Oh ah, no! <laughs> Fuck! What <laughs> man? Let me in. Wow. <laughs> oh Jesus! God. <laughs> All right. You didn't need that dignity anyway. <laughs> oh shit! This woman is uh, reportedly mad at him for a lewd post that he made on Facebook or oh, some shit. shit. Oh shit! What he say? And she just slaps him up. Is she his wife? Probably. Oh. Don't you make those lewd posts? No lewd posts. She caught him trolling for pussy on the Facebook. Oh, uh oh! Forgive me. Uh, She's way bigger than him. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Why they ain't fighting back? Yeah, dude, he's got his hands in the prayer position, dude. He's just like, all right, whatever, bitch slap me if you want to. He's peaceful inside. He's literally bowing to her, like, please, please spare my miserable life. 
Fuck this second though. I think we know who runs this relationship. This guy wears the pants. One thousand apologies. <laughs> One thousand apologies. <laughs> Dude, I wish we had a translator on this shit. Yeah, that'd be nice. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Now, now it's her turn. Now it's her turn. Wow, she's hitting harder. Akron. I think everyone has to slap him. Did you learn your lesson, little Billy? Oh, I, don't, I doubt they're even done yet, dude. Jeez. What the fuck is I going don't know on what now? That, I don't know the what the point of that is. Cock. She's calling it the big slap. They're launching a slap from space. Damn, dude. A slap from fucking Mars. I don't know what's going on now. Yeah. Well, they stopped slapping him. Wheelchair so. scammer situation. Scammer. Scammer. Down real. Kensington Ave. What's up, man? You good? Hey, what's up, man? Chilling at Wawa. You all right? What's up? Yeah, I'm kind of messed up, man. I'm in a bad spot. I wonder if you can help me, man. Like, what's wrong? I got, I got an accident, man. I ain't, I ain't walking with a muff, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I you paralyzed. Walking. Can you work? I'm paralyzed. You paralyzed. I can't, I can't get off. Oh, dude. Work. I guarantee he's going to knock him over or something. So, was you born that way? I wasn't born this way. I was. How long you, was, you can't walk at all? No, nah, I had it. My leg, How much money you got so far? I ain't got nothing right now, Nobody ain't give you no money while you was out here begging? Ain't nobody out here. Wow. Ain't nobody so you out here. Crippled. You just crippled. You just a cripple. Huh. Huh. Yeah, okay. Yo! Huh. Yo, it's a miracle. I thought you was crippled. Wow, dude. Jesus. Dude, Jesus. <laughs> He was lying? Dude, what the fuck? He was you just fucked my whole hustle up. Who was his co-conspirator? The crackhead from around the corner? Uh, I guess. You just fucked my whole hustle up, bitch. Son? This motherfucker can walk. Yo, man. <laughs> <laughs> God, Wheel your ass man. away. <laughs> Got him. Dude, you know what you need to do? You that seems staged. It, it does. What? Yeah. That seems totally staged. Oh, come on. But whatever. It's still funny. Racist woman calling us yeah. terrorists. Whoa. I think I may have watched this on my stream. Let's take a look. Let's see. A bitch. Yeah. Put, no. put it on your face. Put it on his face. Alright, let's see. All What's right, up, guys? Go. So, we're over here filming over here, exercising. Look what this lady wants. Filming over here. Let us know. Go ahead. I said you're... I think we watched this on the show a while back. Yeah, I yeah, think, one time. I think we did, too. Come yeah. back. Uh-huh. Your child pedophiler. Uh-huh. Child pedophilers. Child pedophilers. Ped what is a pedophile? Is that like what you're like? Is that your profession? <laughs> uh, yeah, I grew up to be a pedophiler. Uh, I go to parks and cruise for young children. It's a child uh, pedophilers. I'm a child pedophiler. There you go. Agate bitches uh -huh. that turn into terrorists. Okay. Yeah. Terrorists. They fuck each other's asses. Okay. Suck each other's dick. All right, I'm confused. Are they fucking each other, or are they blow? Are they terrorists, or are, are they, they child pedophilers? They're all of those. All of those things. So they're. Having sex oh, with each other, they're having sex with kids, yep. and they're blowing up buildings. Yes. Okay. A lot of and stuff. Rape children and turning and you're ter terrorists now because you hate yourself so much. Now you're taking pictures in front of a plane to remind you of 9/11. Uh -huh. What? I'm gonna feel stupid taping this, right? Put it on you. They're gonna feel stupid. I don't think it's them that feel stupid. All right, now let's get our license plate. Hey, you, can't make this up. you cannot make this shit up. What the fuck? Let me get your license plate. Let me get your license plate, you terrorist. Whoa. Put your license plate down. Oh, you so American that you look like you're not terrorist? You're a terrorist. Yeah, just feel free to park in the middle of the street. I'm putting y'all on Facebook. Go ahead. I'm putting y'all terrorists on Facebook. Something tells me their angle is going to get more views. You're American terrorists. You're an American terrorist. Brain. Oh my brain. god. Show how, everybody how whose dick you suck. How stupid Show everybody whose dick what? you suck. About god. Show everybody whose dick, dick you suck. Like a dumbass. Show hey, everybody hey, whose hey, dick you hey, his. Hey, his hey, dick. He's a hoarder too. Oh, you're a fucking hoarder. <laughs> yeah. His his dick. Come on, look at this. Why why would you yeah, even do American. this? Like some people just get off on this bullshit. You're a fucking Middle Eastern and you're a hoarder watching American television. 
watch American television about orders? That's American television. What? That's American what? television. That's we're, yeah, that's American television. What the fuck? That's American television. She's not. I think dude. she's saying like, why are you guys even watching hoarders? Because that's American TV, and you guys hate America because you're terrorists and you're child pedophilers and you fuck each other's asses yeah. and you suck each other's dicks because you hate pedophiles. yourself. Uh, she's obviously fucking crazy, dude. Uh, no, these fucking terrorists, child raping motherfuckers. Have you not been paying attention to what she's saying? They're the ones who I'm are crazy. I'm paying attention to what she's saying, but. Uh, None of it seems like it's backed by anything but fucking conjecture. I don't you suck his dick, you fuck his ass. They're trying to act like they're so cool about 9 11. When did that. Did they, did they, did they have a video call? Are they making a 9 11 pro 9 11 video? You, the guy taping it, you suck his dick. He sucks your dick. Hey, you yeah, both bend of, over. Kind of shirt is that? Okay, well, she is talking That's about right. dicks more than That's Paul. Not you. Africa what is loves going on God. here? You don't love God. You don't love God. Africa you loves don't God. Love Jesus. Don't you don't love Jesus. Oh, there's a bunch of Arabs that live in Africa. You don't love a Jesus. You don't love Jesus. No one loves <laughs> Jesus but me. Me. I love Jesus, and you don't love Jesus. You don't love Middle East. You don't love Middle Eastern. It must be cold out there because I see some nips. Oh, uh, I didn't see them uh, until yeah. you pointed it out. You see them nips right you there. Don't love Middle Easterns. You, you don't love Middle Easterns. You don't love Middle Easterns. Middle East. You don't love Middle Easterns. You don't love Middle Easterns. So fucking annoying, dude. You don't love no Middle Easterns. You don't love Middle Easterns, dude. You do not love Middle Easterns in America. You do not love Middle Easterns in America. Crazy. You do not love Middle Easterns in Middle Easterns. Crazy. You do not love Middle Easterns. They hate what? Middle Easterns in America. I'm not they in the Middle Eastern. You live in all your. Oh they God. They hate Middle Eastern. Please take me in this American fucking Japanese Asian bullshit. This American Japanese Asian bullshit. This rant has gone completely <laughs> off the fucking rails at this point. God, she's dumb. It started off the rails. When was it on the rails? Middle I mean, Easterns. at least it had kind of a point. She was like, "You're fucking his ass, yeah. and he's fucking your uh, ass, and you're sucking his dick." That's also true. Uh, Jesus is a prophet in Islam, so saying Muslims don't believe in Jesus makes literally no sense. He's set on fire, like he's gonna set on fire in hell. Uh, he's a, he hates wow, Middle Easterns. He hates <laughs> Middle Easterns. Why? He hates Middle Easterns in America. Goodbye. It's the weirdest thing ever. You hate Middle Easterns. Everyone hates Middle Easterns. Hey, wh why don't you find something better to do? Tape and play. Tape and video of a mid of a um, airplane. Exactly. Get that. Get that. You Even if he was. Child molesters that hate Middle Easterns in America. Whoa. In the Middle East. You think you're so cool. You think you're so cool taping an American from a Middle Easterner that hates Middle Easterns and hates Middle Easterns in America. Crazy! <laughs> I don't she even, is crazy! I'm this makes no, it doesn't make any sense. You can't figure it it's out. The craziest I'm really trying to follow it. Dude, fu yeah, fucking nuke Florida, dude. Yeah, I agree at this point. Is this Florida? Yeah. Oh, nuke, of course nuke this is fucking Florida. Florida, dude. <laughs> you know, I need to go to church. You're going to hell. You think that's an American way to laugh at heaven? You're going to heaven. You're going to heaven. Yeah, you're going right away, bitch. Save her, God! What? Yeah, he's the one that needs oh, attention. He's the attention whore here. Yeah, fucking, you nailed it. <laughs> gotcha. You know what I'm saying is real in Middle East and in America. You all hate Middle East, don't you? Middle East. Bye. Americans yep. Faggots. Bye. American faggots. Have a great day. That hate Middle Easters. Yep. See ya. Middle yep. Middle Eastern way that make the yep. Middle Easters look fat. They're both God. Middle Eastern. We're not even Middle Eastern. You, you are Middle Eastern. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? You are Middle Eastern. What? Oh, oh my god, they're Brazilian, dude. Middle Eastern, They're dude. Brazilians. They're fucking Brazilian. <laughs> they just pointed to the thing. What an idiot! It's great. Yo, She's nuts, dude. Hey, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Why are you taking pictures of airplanes, first of all? Jesus loves you. Why do you take... I know he does. Jesus is right here. Jesus loves it's right no, there? If Jesus Where? is right Man. there, that's, he needs a move. Where is he? I can't see him. All the right. love of Jesus is just pouring There's out. That. Crazy bitch. There's that shit. Oh shit. Mario, Mario be, be playing, playing T dub. Oh, this is a this is a Mario rap. A Mar. Yeah. Oh no. You wanna play with your Mario game? 
I had a big Rams as a big Tames. Cause Mario might be super, but I'm super duper with a big tuper. Cause no one's gonna hit it like me, cause Mario has oh, a no. big C. But I got the A plus on that test because it's a big mess. Cause a big mess. Mario might be a super man, but I'm gonna have a big tan. He might have went to the past to the, to the future. Autism. But I'm gonna make it. New game have a neutral. Had man, a neutral. Well, is he? I hope he's making this dude, up off the top yeah, of his head, dude. Yeah, I think this is a freestyle, think, dude. I, I hope the I, fuck so. I don't so. know, but I think autism has fucking Because if this again, was dude. Ritz, then that's the saddest shit. I think this is Ritz, dude. Look at him. He's looking at something. Oh, you can't play like the he's two reading. dubs on the mix. Nope, this Man, is, not, you this is Ritz. hit it down with the big town. Man, you can't be like the big brown. My boy Emo, he has a Simo. And Seth and Emo, once they get together, they're going to be the team of the meme. You see, my boy Seth, he can rap like the meth. Wait a minute, how does, how does meth rap? Wow. Is that fa is fast, I guess? I hope faster than this. Dude, this is pretty hot, dude. You couldn't freestyle this good, TJ. Oh, this right. guy at least steps to the mic. That's on. There you go. That is true. That's because he's willing to just make up words if he doesn't have a rhyme. I mean, like, he's just, like, throwing up Mario Super, but I'm Tupa Koopa Loopa. With a big looper. Tupa. Man, you can't even hit Handle him with a big, big mess. Man, you can't beat him because he's going to see him. Man, he's going to hit it down with a big town. I'm going to make, make it round. round. I had a big town in a town. I, went, I came from a place named Charlotte. My boy Kevin bought a lot. He's gonna hit it down like a brada match. Like a brada match? Like What's a what? brada match? He can skateboard like the top, top boy, boy, Tony, Tony Hawk. Hawk. But you think Tony Hawk's a cool boy? Well, Kevin got some more of the toilet. He's gonna this is terrible it green like screen. a toilet. Man, he's... Yeah, because that's typically what you do with toilets. Unfold them. You unfold, unfold it like a toilet. <laughs> unfold it like a toilet. I don't remember unfolding the toilet ever, but okay. Take it, that food out the fridge. Like, don't spoil it. Yeah, like it you is. unfold the lid back when you go to take. Man, once that man made the toilet, everyone thought it was so awesome. Once that man made the toilet, everybody thought it was so awesome. <laughs> what it's going to be a toss -up, up between my boy Kevin and that man. And see, today is the day that I'm going to play the game with the big man. I'm going to show you what's up and what's not up. Because it's going down in my town. <laughs> You write me down in your book because I'm gonna have the hooks. Oh the shit. Tits. Man, all the ladies want me. Yeah. <laughs> the the I'm, I'm sure they do. Play the Mario. See, he is a princess, but I get all the others. Hot princesses. She wants one, I want all the others because it's gonna be a sucker. What? See, I'm the pimping man of the big ran. Dude. This guy's a P. I oh, am yeah, dude. motherfucking what, P. What I think of this guy is all, the guy getting all the bitches, getting all the money, doing everything right in life, dude, living the fucking American this is dream. The guy. I think of this, this dude is right the here. Fucking guy. Drowning in pussy. Just the oh, only dude. person I can think of that's got more game is the YB and Atheist guy. Oh, uh, well, I mean, you can't touch him. Well. When you want to be in a band, well, I'll be your main man to get you out of that rant. Because he's coming down with a town. I feel bunny noses are gonna be found in the big round town. <laughs> Play this, boys, cause it's Gnarson with the toys. Oh no! It's, yeah. Kinda quit playing with your toys, cause the Mario Dude. ain't even the Atari. You wanna play the. Garbario? You know, you know Paul? Uh. <laughs> You had some pretty, pretty failed attempts at rapping. Um, dude, I did. But you did. know what? I, I'll tell you what. You were definitely not the bottom of the barrel, dude. No. Not even close. Yeah, not even close. This shit is fucking, this is unbelievably bad. This shit bad. is Garbario, dude. Did you want to play with Garbario? <laughs> Garbario? <laughs> yes, <laughs> exactly. This is Garbario, dude. With the moise and everything. I have the toys with the moise. And everybody knows. He makes up fucking words, dude. Everybody knows it's coming down with them toys. With them toys. With them toys. With them toys. toys. Man, my boys don't even play with games anymore. He, they're on the rings of the dames. What? Man, I don't even know. Hit it down with the town. I had a uh, big brown. I had a big town. Of a what bound. the fuck is this shit, dude? I rebound that ball and shoot it. He's gonna be hit with a fucking turtle shell, top, dude. <laughs> top. <laughs> Man, what when the they fuck? want something good, they come to me. Cause I'm gonna be like to see. Thank That's you. Nice. You should fucking thank me for watching this fucking shit.
Well, that dude, was the, that dude should be drawn and quartered. <laughs> Eminem, move the fuck over, bitch. You get new champion. Oh, man, there's a new rap god in town. So, uh, have we ever seen autism levels quite that high? Um, I don't think so. We have had Egghead on our show a couple yeah. of times. I mean, uh, this guy can even give Egghead a run for his money on the tism scale. Maybe so. Hey, I want Egghead should do a rap about key lime pie Oreos. Should wrap his next Oreo review. That'd be awesome. <laughs> You fucking throw a stick at me. You throw shit. You keep throwing shit at me. That's foam. It doesn't fucking matter. So these are larpers. Oh, they're having a larp fight. Well, they dude. were yeah, they were larping with their foam swords, and then one dude pu picked up a Lightning stick. Bolt. One dude threw a stick, and now dude, this it's this on. fight escalates, dude. Here, I'll hit Hold you in the fingers. Hold your hands out. I'll hit you in the fingers. Hold your hands out. I'll hit you. Oh shit, bit oh bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Okay. Let's go. Hit him. Hit him, dude. It's hard as what? a bone. <laughs> Fight. <laughs> Fight. <Damn. laughs> Slap oh, oh, oh. Fight. Slap yeah. oh. The little guy stuck him like three times. <laughs> uh oh. oh. Ground and pound ah! now. Ah! Let's try. Ah! Fuck you, asshole. Fuck you. I'm telling my mom. <laughs> my mom's gonna hear about this. My mom will hear dude, of this. This, guy's <laughs> this is the weakest fight ever, dude. Get up. The fight in the room is oh, more manly than this. Oh, this is a bitch boy <laughs> slap fight. Did you just not hit me with a fucking stick? Damn. Stop him. This fucking hurts. Stop him! It hurts! Fucking stab him! Get the fuck off of me! Oh, shit. So oh, why, shit. Would, why would you go back for yeah, more? Just if you want him off of you, then don't it. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> give up. Yeah, time Come on, to give it's up. time to go. Come on. Don't bring it up. Come on. Don't bring it up. What's this fucking little kid? Oh, Jesse, dude, come on. Do you, you fucking. The kid in the jacket clearly has the advantage. Oh, shit. Been knocked out. Oh shit, he's going for the knockout <laughs> They're looking at their dancing. dancing. <laughs> la da 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 It's all your fucking God, fault! God, dude. This is so sad. <laughs> it's your fault! Why are you doing this? Oh. Obviously you guys just can't LARP together. <laughs> it's a fuck! He throws a stick at me! Oh. Bitch boy! Slap fight. Hold your hands what? out. What do you mean? What's this obsession with holding your hands he out? He wants to hit him with a stick. Hold your hands out. Hit Show him with a stick. Hey, don't say that in front of your mom, dude. Punch me in the face again and I'll fucking break your jaw! Oh, she's going out. I don't think either of you has jaw-breaking abilities. What the fuck's going on? Uh-oh. Oh. What the fuck is going on? Get the fuck over here! <laughs> oh shit! Uh, oh uh oh! Uh -oh. The fuck uh -oh. Going on? Fucking oh, going dude, on! Their dad looks like a bear. Look at him! Oh, oh. I am the law. Get the fuck in here! Get in oh, here! Shut shit. up! Dude. Oh, oh shit! shit. Yeah, it was time to turn off the yeah, camera. Yeah, the cameraman <laughs> got called out at yeah. the end there too. Turn shit. that fucking camera off, boy! Turn fucking fucking beat you up! Off. I beat you up! Uh uh! Break <laughs> your jaw! I break your jaw! <laughs> Y'all interrupted my NASCAR and beer time. Yeah, dude. Don't, don't interrupt daddy's NASCAR and beer time, boy. Sad but very racist band commercial. <laughs> Jesus. What is it, little white child? <laughs> Damn. Uh, no. It's a lot of work for a fucking balloon. He gives no fucks, But he dude. did it out of the kindness of his heart. Wow. God, he's gonna get, like, rub burn. Oh, sh- Wow, what a bitch! Racism. Sad to be a black man. This one has a twist, though, that I didn't see coming. Oh, shit, dude. So many balloons. He sleeps on a toothbrush? 
What? Dude, I figured it Dude, out. It's black, black herbal, herbal toothpaste. Cool. That is one of the weirdest fucking commercials I've ever Dude, seen. Even yeah. for a Japanese one. And look or at whatever look, that was. Look at it. It's racist as fuck too, because it's like it's like a black person. You may not like it, but it's really doing you a favor every day. Well, <laughs> if it works, awesome. Police harassment. The tall whites don't follow me. Tall whites, you alien. Shut up, alien. Whoa, alien. Y'all alien. Don't come walking towards me. I'm in fear of my life from you aliens. I don't care what you exercise. You an alien. I don't care what you exercise. You not. You not a Dude, part of this world. They period. are Freemasons or they are terrorists. You are a tall white. One of the two. Pick I know one. What you are. You are uh, tall white. Not all tall whites are tall. Then why are they called tall whites? Right. I Not all tall whites are tall, dude. Obviously, this guy's happy about it. He's like, "This is the first guy I ever called me tall." You a tall white? You making a, you making a joke out of it? But I know the truth. Y'all are aliens. Y'all don't come from this planet. That's why y'all. Where act do they the come from? <laughs> yeah, y'all complimented you. Right. You are alien. Aliens. A bunch of fucking aliens. Cr cracker aliens. White people are aliens. White people are aliens. Why, why you asking who he is? Don't question nobody around here. Don't question nobody. You better not ask nobody. No motherfucking question. Not one. Suck my dick, bitch. Don't talk to me, bitch. Fuck you, dick sucker. Don't say shit. Stop talking to me, bitch. Fuck you, dick. Suck. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> God, this guy is nuts. No questions. You can't ask nobody no questions, bitch. Quit asking people questions. What the, who are you talking to like that? Who you talk to like that, bitch, motherfucker? Get off the street. Don't talk to me. Get, the Get the fuck away from me, bitch. I'm gonna fear my life. I'm gonna kill you if you touch me. Kill don't me. touch me. <laughs> don't uh -oh. touch me. I'm in fear of my life. Don't touch me. <laughs> I'm in fear of my fucking life. I'm in fear of my fucking life. I'm in fear of my fuck you, bitch. I'm in fear of my life. Don't walk <laughs> up on me, bitch. Suck my dick. Uh, you're following yeah, them. You're following them, dude. These crazy people all want their big audience. Oh, of course, dude. <laughs> what the Yes, I can resist any unlawful motherfucker come up on me. That's right. You unlawful, bitch. You unlawful. You can't ask me that question, bitch. Suck my dick. You can't ask me no questions, bitch. So, is it this dick guy's pastime? He just follows cops around no as questions. they walk around? Get the fuck out of here. Alien. Tall white. All white <laughs> people are alien. Tall white. I, I don't know. I wasn't aware of this. Are we all aliens? Uh, I have heard that before. Huh. Uh, this guy's obviously crazy, TJ. Why the fuck would uh -huh. we be on? Why the fuck would we be on this planet? Well, like the. I think the idea is that like the aliens spliced their genes with like normal humans, which were all black uh, and indigenous wow. people. I mean, you're pretty. So tall we're like half breeds. Yeah, we're like we're like. Alien monsters. Well, you know what? The created. taller you are, probably the more alien blood you have. Look how tall TJ is. Sweet. So I'm like mostly alien. You're mostly alien, dude. That's good. I'm glad. I'm, I'm, I don't really like people. All white people are aliens. Well, Look how they just go in these people's car. This car just opened up this door and went in people's car. Just too late. It's recorded. It's recorded. Uh huh. Yep. You can't ask nobody no questions. You can't tell nobody to go home. <laughs> you can't ask nobody no questions. You can't tell nobody to go home. Yeah, they can. He just did. What, you have to kill? You have to kill? How to kill. Yep. You have to kill? That's it. You trying to kill somebody? Yeah, oh. you being recorded, bitch. If they're out to kill someone, I think they'd choose you at this point. Yeah. yeah. You're, you're the easy I know choice. I would. The squeaky wheel gets the grease, dude. Multi-billion dollar lawsuit. Multi a multi-billion multi dollar? Ain't no such thing as dispersion. Ain't no such thing as no dispersion. Police harassment like a motherfucker. Let him go. Let him go, bitch. Ain't no dispersal. Let him go, bitch. Ain't no dispersal. Let him go. Y'all bogus as hell. Can't they do something like uh, disorderly white, conduct or something like that? Is what? Could oh, they give him like disorderly oh, conduct? Oh, there's a or bunch something? of shit they could do if they really. But I don't think they would want to fuck with this guy. He's obviously probably known in this area for being a crazy fuck. Racist motherfuckers. 
Ain't no gangs out here, bitch. Ain't no such thing as no gang. So you can't get nobody. There's no first, such thing as bitch. a gang. That's for gang members only. Ain't no gang members out here, bitch. Okay. Dick sucks. Well, that's, man, that's, the police that's, is that's, the gang. That's bitch. doubtful. Well, they are really a white gang. White supremacist bitch. But all of them. They aliens. Tall whites. You mad because I know who you are. You mad because I know you ain't fucking alien. Tall whites. Nothing. Nothing. He ain't do shit. This bitch motherfucker right what here. What is the tall whites thing? Out to kill. Who knows? Tall whites. Y'all aliens. Out to kill. Tall whites. Y'all aliens. These aliens are out to kill, dude. How come whenever someone's really crazy or really stupid, they just say the same shit over and over again? They got again. nothing else to say, dude. Tall whites, dude. Tall whites. This is a broken record of fucking bullshit. This is called What a Wedding. <laughs> Woo! Yay! It's fantastic. More noise! Yeah! More white Woo! people noise! Yeah! Yay! White balloons! What is this dorky ass shit? Oh, dude. They're releasing the balloons. It's beautiful. What an occasion. I'm so happy! Uh, Still waiting for the punchline on this. I don't know this. if that's right. true. Uh -huh. Peace. Yeah. Yeah. Are they gonna fall? Yep. Oh, what an idiot! Yes. Oh, what idiots! <laughs> oh, what a moron! What the fuck was that? Why did he drive that fast? What the that hell happened? What happened? What you mean the, the hell happened? You mean when somebody's sitting on the back of a tiny little car and it takes off all fast, they fall out? I ain't I never heard of no it. physics. What? What a beautiful occasion, though. What Congrats the hell to the happy happened? couple. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, Do you they think they'll ever find true love? They, they probably spent their honeymoon in the emergency yeah, room. Yeah, dude, in the ICU. Yeah. With bandages you don't on have their to be heads. lonely with FarmersOnly.com. You don't have to be lonely. Will Dave ever find love? Student Union rocks. Cool. Sounds uh, cringy. Is it that it rocks or they have rocks? Is it playing? Is it just black at the beginning? What is this? I don't know. At least you're not. There it is. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there it is. a big section of darkness at the beginning of it. Welcome to Lowboro Students Union. Oh my god. Dude, doesn't uh, this make you want to go sign up for college and No. Oh, this is cool. Is this... Yeah. Oh no. White people dancing is horrendous. Yeah. Fuck. Maybe they were right about the alien oh, thing. Oh no, that was more they're multiplying. The tall whites are here. Dude, um okay, he was right about us being aliens. This right. is not natural. Oh man, I feel a piss coming on, dude. No you don't. Hey. We're exec. At nope. the students' uni ah. where you'll find us Volunteer Yeah And meet Nightlife says room one on fire Get involved, your time will tire Oh god Paul. Did the same guy that wrote the Mario song write the, write the lyrics for this thing? This yeah. is, what is this, Paul? Dude, you, uh, I, I gotta tell you, I've pulled three fucking shows worth of videos in the last four days. Yeah, dude. Dude, the barrel has been scraped. This is the bottom? Yeah. Like, okay. I pulled I pulled everything that was even minorly watchable from everything that we had. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is, is ass. Uh, pay folks, we need new videos. Yeah, start, send, start sending. Find them. good shit. Send us better shit. Cause we don't. I don't want to watch this, <laughs> but I have no choice. We don't have enough not to. Oh my God! Die of AIDS. <laughs> There's loads. What does that mean? You can shake your bucket for the rag. <laughs> what is a what rag? Who's on the rag? This bitch? 
That sucks. Find people who can sing. No. Oh, God. Maybe a bomb goes off at some point. Dude, I hope that, like, Freddy Krueger shows up and just, like, chops these people up or something. I mean, this is not I don't, good. I don't, I don't think it's going to happen. Yes, we promise you the time of your life. Well, you're already not delivering on that. <laughs> DJ Cocktail Salsa Skydive. Dude, I watched The Room today, and this is, this is bad. This is worse than The Room? Okay, would you rather watch The Room again or watch an equivalent length of this? Uh, The Room. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, Any day, day of the week. Come down to <laughs> yeah, dude. Well, wow, like, statistically speaking, shouldn't one of them have been able to sing by now? Just like law of averages. I don't know, dude. We are always on your side. Postgrads get in touch. But if you <laughs> oh, every time a new one joins, it gets worse. How are you even worse than the last? There's loads for you to do at LSU. Gain some professional experience in media. Oh. Come to our welfare event. When you made this, did you think anybody would come to any event with you? Yeah, I mean, like, if, if I was even considering going to this school and I saw this, I'd be like, well, there goes that ambition. Dear God. <laughs> oh my God. Dear fucking God. <laughs> yeah, dude, this is the bottom of the bonus bucket, folks. Bless you. Always on your side. Rig-zack, exec, exec, bless you. Here at Alice. la 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 Wow, this is the, <laughs> the worst fucking song I've ever heard. Congratulations. More than your course, we're exec, exec, exec at LSU. Here at LS, L L L L L L L L S U. I need some LSD. Time of your life. Here at LS, L L L L S U. Here at LS. Oh God! If another one says L L L L S U, I'm gonna kill myself live. Exec, exec at LSU. Come and experience Okay, she's not world. doing it. She heard me. We won bugs for 33 years. AAU. Action on the big society. They heard me. Ward. Ask your committee to try it. Your experience now. Hold on. Isn't that a woman singing? Yeah, but I don't know. Now let's start it. There's loads for you to do at LSU. For four years, Rack has raised a million. Democracy gives you the chance to speak. Sport, you can't top it. Oh you God. Can you drop it. All right. <laughs> oh. oh, God. All right. Oh, oh. LS, LLLLLLLLS, you. LLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLL
The seagulls are like, let's uh, get out of here. This guy's obviously nuts. I think it's the other way around. Canadian goose. Fuck it. We yep. must close down the borders. Yes. We must build a wall. Yes. yes! You know what? I take everything we back. Must I just build said. A wall. No more Canadian geese in America. No. How would a wall keep a fucking goose out? I don't out? care. Build the fucking wall. You build it high enough, dude. You, you know have to what? build giant nets. I fucking take. If I ever say anything bad about G Time Johnny, I take it back immediately. I know, dude. This guy is fucking on to something. We were building the wall in the wrong location. We need to fucking close the border with Canada. We need to fucking nuke Canada. We need to get a war with Canada immediately. We need to take over these people and enslave them and take the. I'm pretty stands. sure nuking Canada would cause damage to our country. You know too. what? Collateral damage is acceptable. <laughs> Hashtag can't, move the can't wall. Can't make north. an omelet without breaking you know a few what? eggs. Toronto, Vancouver, Montreal, we all need to be erased tomorrow. Trump, do something as president. Take care of these That's fucking That's how you know Canadians. Trump's a joke. He hasn't destroyed yeah, Canada it, yet. Oh, build a wall. Yes. Oh, go away, Goosey. Oh, Goosey, Goosey. Have a piece of dog food. There you go. Goosey, Goosey. Take this dog food from my hand for everybody. Oh, I love you, Goosey, Goosey. <laughs> He's like, fuck you. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> As it swims away. You're a disheveled, <laughs> crazy man that came out of the Dude, woods. Good for you. It's like, get away from me, you fucking you know what, psycho. You know what geese don't normally do when they see you like this? They fucking hiss at you. They yeah. see G-Time Johnny, it's just like, nope. Uh, yep. No, that in one's the, crazy. In the water, whoop. Should we attack that human, Dad? No, nah, that one ain't right. Get in the water and swim. Yeah, something wrong with him. <laughs> <laughs> the boy ain't right. All right, you guys like the Beatles? Is it Eleanor Rigby cover? Nuke the geese. By, uh, we've had a lot of interesting music on tonight's show. Yeah, it's a musical selection. Ah, look at all the lonely hey, people. Hey. Ah, There's no, mu no music. It's a cappella. Ah, look at all the lonely people. Ah, look at all the lonely people. Lonely people. Lonely people. Lonely people. Lonely people. Lonely people. Of the rice in the church where the wedding has been. There's no Living mic. In a dream. <laughs> Waits at the window. Where the face that he sees in a jar by the door. Who is it for? All the lonely people. Oh my god, it's a beautiful version and of the song. Step aside, the Beatles. All the lonely people. I think, uh,. I think we. It's actually a good thing John Lennon died before he could see this. You're right, dude. Oh, oh, look at if, if John Lennon had seen this, he would have realized his version is nothing. In yeah, comparison. he killed himself. Yeah, he would have. You know? Corpse Midget even like, he would have realized how beautiful Corpse Midget's version was and just been like, wow, what do we even waste our time being the Beatles for? Oh yeah, this is great. This is a masterpiece. No one comes near. Look at him working, donning his socks in the night while there's nobody there. What does, does he, he care? care? All the lonely people. people. Where do they all come from? All do you the know what? People. He can relate to the song. I feel like the corpse midget on the left. Dude, you feel like the one on the left? Yeah, the one on the left. The one that's kind of just no, fading this away. Is, this yeah. is not a Paul song. This is a song about Corpse Midget, how lonely he is. You know, one All is the, the lonely people. He needs dude. to do like one is the loneliest number, dude. He really one needs to do that. Is the loneliest number. Where do they all belong? I don't know. I don't know. Where do they belong? Ah, look at all the lonely people. Ah, look at all the lonely people. Yeah. Ah, look at all the lonely people. Lonely people. <laughs> Oh my God! It just keeps going. See, this is what this is what it, he thinks this is cool. I mean, it's pretty close to being so bad it's good, but it's not quite there. Yeah, it's really just so bad it's awful. Because the atten the intent behind it was to be good. Wiping the dirt from his hands as he walks from the grave. Basically. No one was saying all the lonely people. Where do they all come from? The all dance. the lonely people. Where do they all belong? I don't know. All where? How long is Eleanor Rigby people. again? <laughs> Not that long of a song. Where do they all come from? All the lonely people. Where do they all belong? 
long. Yeah. Great job. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Like, favorite, share, and comment. <laughs> My comment, do. this is this is awful beyond Holy all reason. Holy fucking shit. Angry Scottish man versus sheep. Versus a sheep. Fucking cunt. This fucking sheep, dude. Fucking move! Fuck sheep. Get off the fucking road. Rood! Go, ya cunt! He was off the road. Yeah, you could have yeah, drove by, then. but you had to talk shit. Fucking hell, man. Get out the fucking road. Fucking move, ya fat dick! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's like, what's up? Sheep's like, fuck, fuck you! Sheik. Fuck sick! Ya fat dick! <laughs> fucking hell. Dude, Go. just give the sheep a ride, dude. Go! Fuck off! Fuck off. You fucking, fucking shit! <laughs> All right, there's a little slice of life fucking for angry move. Scottish men. <laughs> if you're an angry Scottish man, this is part of your daily routine. Chasing sheep out of the road. Machete too. Yeah, bro. This oh. is crazy shit. It's a sequel to the other one we watched. It's got it's got a lot of build up, but it, the end is worth the well, price of right admission. Right now, all I can see is a tree. Yeah, I think this person relocates. Presented pretty soon. in glorious tree vision. There we go. Yeah. They found a non-tree version. Shit's about to go down. What the fuck is going on? What? Some, sort, in, some sort of dispute. He's Let's got see. a machete. 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 His name is Machete. Is he just yelling at random cars that drive by? Oh, oh no! Shit. Oh no, he's not. Fuck you, bitch! Hit me! Car punch time! Yeah, fucking car punch to the fucking rescue! Dude, a new challenger is entering. Oh the shit! Ring. Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh my fucking god! Damn, dude. It's machete guy versus cars trying to hit him. Dude, there's a there's a blockbuster movie there somewhere. This nigga got back up. This nigga got back up. This nigga got back up. That is pretty shocking. He got run directly oh, the fuck over. He keeps like walking across the street and just yelling at people. Maybe don't pick fights with people in cars if you're just on foot. Probably not a good idea. Sorry, I got spit. Oh, sorry, audience, you got spit. <laughs> oh, that dude's back to hit him again? Damn. Maybe this dude should just go inside. Yeah. It's probably not a good idea. No, here come the fucking police. They didn't come up here if you want to. 5 0 showing up. Right now. Ooh, what's gonna happen here? I think the popos are probably going to take him away. I'm thinking so. They're coming to take me away. Oh, at the end of it? Yeah, and it, it must have got boring from there. To so the yeah. loony factory with him. Psycho old man. Well, I don't want to spoil what he does, but it's going to be fun. He's coming. Oh, oh shit. shit. He's got some in his hand. He don't look like he's too happy. Oh, shit. That window's going to be gone. You better drive away. That's oh. the things the police use. Yeah. He's got a baton. No. You're gonna be. Why? You're gonna be in a fucking hospital if you don't get out of here. No, you can't it's bring Canadian. a weapon out on me. <laughs> yes, I can, because I have one. Because I have one, bitch. I guess that's, that's true. He does have a weapon. Yeah, you can't tell him what he can't do. Get out of here! Dude, you're in a What's car. What's your name? Dennis Kissington. Dennis get the fuck out of here. Kissington. Yes. That's that's the Get last name of, of everybody in our chat by coincidence. Tizzington. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis Tizzington. I'm gonna the break. whole Tizzington family. We're gonna call us. this the De Dennis Tizzington Memorial Chat. <laughs> 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 oh, that's two you're windows. Going to jail, bud. Yeah, you are. Too fucking old for that. You're not. Uh, uh, they would never take an no. old man Dude, to jail. You're an idiot. I don't think there's an upper age limit on the jail. If shit. you're if you're not too old to be smashing people's windows with a baton, then you ain't too old to go to jail. I hate to break it to you. I mean, bitch. what? Sh there's just crazy people like this. 
BPX 508050. Well, I mean, All I kind of assumed that that's what it would look like. I in found there. Uh, I found uh, like a news story about this. Did he go to jail? This happened last. Um, this happened last August, August 2016. Mm. Huh. Um, let's see. It says uh, mischief charges for shocking Alberta window smash video. <laughs> Fucking can't. D another reason to build the wall. <laughs> wow. Keep them out. These fucking Canadians are out of control. Look at them, dude. Violent. You see the shit they're doing. You see the shit they're doing. You saw we that cannot goose. have this. This guy's they're not sending, too. They're not sending our, their best people, dude. Look, I'm too old for jail. I'm too old to have any fucking consequences from this action. It's I'm like, too old for that. It's like, dude, he's filming you. And not to mention, why does he want him to leave so bad? Like, what happened? It says here, um... Let's see. It says, <sighs> uh, Renee Gray, who states sh that she's a relative of, uh... Of this guy, Dennis Tizzing, um, has written to the Inquisitor reporting that her family has been receiving hate text messages and phone calls from block callers and fake Facebook accounts. Huh. Okay. She has also provided photos of property damage said to have been part of the events leading up to Dennis Tizzington's breaking Damien Dolan's car windows in the video. So, so he, these he people thought, have some kind of weird Hatfield McCoy type feud shit going I, on. That's well, what they're claiming. Either that, or he's paranoid and he thinks everyone around yeah. his house. Who, who is knows? Who knows the truth? Of crazy. It. Well, that one's over. Um, knockout porn. Oh, this is another one of those like weird porn things. Knockout I think. porn. Okay. Hold up. Female sleeper hold nuked out production. Megan's Jones. Cool. Really? Ba 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 da ba ba da. I've seen this kind of shit before. It's like it's like women in bikinis acting like they're wrestling. Yeah, G rated porn. Oh wow. This one is centered all around sleeper holds though. Like guys that like women that are like right before they pass out of the sleeper hold, I guess. I, I she guess. doesn't even have it locked in tight on her. Oh yeah. Oh no, it, dude. It, it's all acting. Is that what you'd call it? <laughs> I, uh, that's kind of what I mean, it is. Horrifying. It's, it's well, I know it's on a higher level than you ever have acted. I mean, that is true. We did just watch The Room. so Dude. I am being knocked out. You're knocking me out, Lisa. Yeah, knock that bitch out. She, oh, she's passing out, dude. You guys mind clearing the room for a few minutes? <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm rock hard. I'm ready to go. Oh shit! Yeah, there it is. You have been knocked, knocked that out. bitch out. Whoa! Now Get off gonna... me now, bitch! Oh, now you're going in the leg lock. Oh, the leg lock. Ooh. That looks even less convincing. It's a head scissor. Yeah, you she might. cannot escape. There's no possible way to escape this. Crush your head like a grape, bitch. Dude, this must be the easiest porn money ever. Yeah, dude. Yeah, all you gotta do is like flop around for a minute. I bet oh, these chicks were getting knocked out. Oh. oh god, her leg is choking oh, me to death. So, oh, I can't escape. Oh, I'm being the struggle. Out. Oh, I'm getting knocked out again. Oh, look, I'm fading. I'm fading. I'm fading. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. And jizz. All right. Jizz. Next hold, please. Next hold. Isn't <laughs> it? Isn't it dangerous to knock somebody out like this? Yeah, but. They're since like these holds are totally unconvincing. It's, look how <laughs> wobbly she is on her feet. She can't even resist any longer. She still has the consciousness to move her hair out of the way, though. Oh hi, TJ. How's your sex life? Better than this, I guess. Huh? <laughs> oh, you're getting knocked out once again, green bikini bitch. <laughs> You know the funny thing is right Black now, bikini bitch has dude, your fucking number. Some of our audience right now is like, oh my god. Yeah, right there. Mikkel Bermit or whatever. Yeah, dude. You know, some of our audience has got to be into this shit. Yep. This is porn for who? For whoever the fuck is into this. Dude, there's a whole group of people that are into this shit, man. You're getting punished. You're getting knocked out. Wrestler porn. That's a sexy noise. <laughs> 
Yeah, toss it. Now toss it. Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh, Whoa, oh, is that a free feel up there? <laughs> Jiggle them titties a little, you know what I'm saying? Look at it. Look how knocked she, out she's she like is, a fucking, man. Yeah, she's, <laughs> oh, out. she's out. Whoa, oh, it's oh, ven- oh, revenge no. time for vengeance. Oh, shit. Revenge, revenge time. Revenge time. At least this chick knows how to look like it's semi-locked in. Yeah, she's a little bit better. The girl's crossing her that. eyes. Wow, she's going cross-eyed. What a performer. <laughs> This actually works better than the other arrangement. Dude, what a performer. Yeah, this is actually... Th- she's doing a little bit better. Yeah. This is some serious acting right here. Whoa. Oh, oh back, shit. It's right back to the, the old dynamic. The tables have turned again. Another sleeper hold. Oh, the sleeper hold. Oh. Uh, Don't uh, even fight it, Coming bitch. buckets now. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah. So hot. So fucking hot! Wow, that's great. Anyway, anus looking good. What? <laughs> anus looking good. Oh no! Oh no! What the fuck, bitch? You really, you really have a lot of songs today, <laughs> Dude, Paul. Fuck. This is a very musical episode. <laughs> I, I like how the beginning is. We were saying a lot of songs, bitch. 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 Put that pussy. I don't think you've ever had to yeah, say dude. that in your life. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you might so. have said the next line though. Okay. I'm only interested in ass play. Yeah, I think he said that before. Yeah, I believe that. I ain't licking pussy like corn on the cob. All I do is win jobs. If he snatches, ruin. It's okay. Give me that anus and I'll bang away. <laughs> this has got. This has got to be a fucking fake troll <laughs> shit. Give me that asshole, slut! <laughs> That's anus licking good. Give me that asshole, slut! That's quite a hook. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's anus, anus licking good. good. Give me that asshole, hey, slut! The, the anal anarchist, the dictator of rectum. I'm only interested in your tight fudge maker, not your pink fluff, bitch. Like a mud pie delight, without but without my hand. Yeah, bitch, get down and please me. What the uh, fuck? That asshole slut? Uh, give me that asshole slut! I love it. How is this guy able to? Be, he's pretty clear. He's pretty clear. You can hear his audio, but the other guy was just like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Give me that asshole slut! I think they should just said that over and over again. Give yeah. me that asshole slut! Dude, Wesley da, Willis da, da, wrote da, da, better songs than this. Da, 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 da. Is this an early like Shane Dawson thing or something? I don't know. Looks kind of like Shane Dawson. Is it? Anus licking good. Give me that. Oh, what? Give me talent? that asshole it is, slut, dude. Give me that asshole slut. Give me that asshole slut. This is definitely Give me that fucking asshole slut. Shit. Yeah. Ain't yeah. that pussy just want that butt? Give me that asshole slut. TJ's inspired. Yeah. Feel that shit. Oh yeah, playing with the keyboard now. Oh, this is awful. Dude, what a beautiful piano solo to okay, end. Okay, let's move on. We don't really have much to move on oh, to. I, there, there's a certain individual I think we should move on to. Oh shit, I didn't pull that fucking you manatee fucking video. I know, dude. God damn. Stupid Paul. Well, it's pretty easy to find. We can find the manatee video. Yeah, there's a certain individual's video. A certain go individual. To, go to my website, Gord TV Radio. God TV Radio situation. Gord. Brett makes some interesting claims. Not 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 anything to do with actually the the subject of the video. Which one is it? It's his. Uh, it should be his latest one. It's it's like funny story Paul's ego or something. Is so it like, on God TV Radio? I think it's on Patreon. I think it's like on YouTube or something or vid. Go to YouTube. Yeah, if you just go to YouTube and search Brett Keen, and make it like this week, it'll it'll be one of the first ones that pops up. Yeah. Come here, that asshole slut. You're gonna have to filter by the week. Let's do a search this, this week. week. Yeah, I think it came out. Games you love, games you love, classic Keen. No. Paul Zigo, yep, funny it's, story it's by one. Brett Keen. Yep, there we go. There's the one. Give me that asshole slut. I'll throw it into the rotation. Give me that asshole slut. TJ likes that song. Give me that asshole slut. Well, he's obsessed with asses. Give me that asshole slut. Give me that asshole slut. 
Gimme. That asshole. Slut. L S L L L L L L L L S U. God TV Radio, if you could be so kind, can you Is Brett wandering into a new dimension? I wish. And perhaps even consider giving Has Brett found a gateway back to the Berenstain universe? The Berenstain universe, dude. I hope that you have a wonderful day. God Did bless. you just say to add the video to the bookmarks? Yes. Add your video bookmark situation, you individual so-and-sos. Bat 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 Filler! Oh, yeah! It's a filler wow. with Brett King! Oh, yeah! Da, 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 back on YouTube, da, 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 even though I said I wouldn't Brett be back! Brett King rocks, oh, yeah! Give me that asshole slut. Please subscribe, comment, and rate before you've actually seen the video. Hey, people. I thought I'd share a funny story today. My wife, she was making some mac and cheese. Of course she was. And we were ready to watch the new Transformers movie with the children. And while she's stirring the mac and cheese, she says... Hey, Why is honey, it that I think that that's a, a, the perfect thing that I can imagine Brett Keen doing? Eating mac and cheese and watching fucking Transformers. Well, I, I think it's bullshit unless he's touring Transformers because it's definitely not out yet. The new one just came out recently. Give me that asshole, so, slut. But Freddy who knows? Some mac and cheese situation. And uh, my children chirped up and they said, oh, yeah, the mac and cheese situation. Yes, yes. <laughs> I don't know if Paul knows this. I don't know if I've ever actually shared this with anybody. But Exclusive ever scoop. since Paul started making fun of my accent, I actually thought it was funny. I actually th- it's actually called a speech impediment. Yeah. Not an accent. I don't think you can really classify it as an accent. I it was so funny that I ended up creating animated cartoons of Paul Zego. Oh, that's why you did it. Uh, you thought it was so funny. Basically imitating him attempting to imitate me. Okay. And my family loves it. My kids, they laugh and they also... Dude, They're the only ones a, then. Hold on. You made a video being like, why don't you stop this fucking mac and cheese? You're always talking about that fucking mac and cheese all the time. So don't pretend like you like it. <laughs> he loves it. Oh, dude. it's such, it, Well, one, it's bullshit because Brett talked this way for years. And when Paul po- pointed it out, Brett fucking stopped talking that way suddenly. Like, he doesn't use those words anymore ex- except when he's joking about it. So if that, that was true, Brett, why why did you talk this way for years and suddenly you switched? And not to mention, it's not just your accent, it's the words you would say over and over again. Like, you'd say situation over and over again. You'd say orn. Be, like, what is it, bin? Instead of bean or something? Bean. Don't yeah, forget Zeo de Dong, dude. Yes. <laughs> the the rind of Zeo de Dong. Uh, the wording. We'll do situation. And uh, I, I will also say, honey, uh, can I have some coffee with some French vanilla with it? Individuals? And uh, wow, if one dude. of my kids is acting up, which they don't often do, I'll say, uh, whatever, oh, Brett. particular individuals being naughty. Oh. Brett, these uh, are, wor- these, are phrases you, these are phrases you use for years. But now <laughs> suddenly it's a joke. So, yeah. Guys, I was in on the joke the whole time. It, it, situation. So wait, wait. <laughs> is, is Brett telling us that his children also laugh at his stupid fucking keenisms too? Yeah, is I that guess so. What this video is yeah. about. So, so your own family's laughing at you too. Sweet, neat. Yeah, and if we're about to watch like a Tom Cruise movie, like The Mummy or something, we'll say, "Oh, it's time for the particular individual Tom Cruise Tommy situation." Yes, yes. So, are your children fans of our show or something? <laughs> like, I think that's what I'm gathering. Yeah, from this. I mean, but I wonder to myself what it's like for Paul. I mean, I myself, I can get a kick out of myself because I know what I'm about. I know who I am. Uh I know that I got fantastic children who've got some of my quirks. And my wife has also adopted a lot of the weird sayings that I do and some of the strange, unusual, silly things that an old man like myself does. You're not that old, Brett. What about Paul? According to Paul's ego's own confession. Yeah, you know. A confession. A confession. Like, you call yourself an old man, but you you realize Paul is only, like, three years younger than you. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. We're not that far apart, Brad. (laughs) Yeah, Brad, you're not old yet, buddy. You look old. You seem old. But you're actually, really, in all actuality, not that old. No. 
he's never going to be able to have children to be able to have oh, works with. What, I can attest that He'll to people. He'll never have those kids around that he can actually joke with. And uh, <laughs> in the morning, whenever he wakes up and he's sitting at the table having breakfast, the so kids pathetic, aren't going Brad. to be there. And he's never going to be able to look into their face and say, Born, Born. wow, look, my son's got my eyes. My daughter... She even talks a little bit like I do. Wow. This is a, Poor Brett's a, kid. Brett's <laughs> achievement in life is that he can come in a pussy, and then about nine months later, some kids can yeah. pop out. Yeah, congrats, Brett. Wow, Brett. Paul's you can do what almost any other human can do. <laughs> That's amazing. Guy, put, put your shoulder on Paul's ego for me, dude. All right, you put your hand on his shoulder. Yeah. Man. yeah. All right. We need to console Paul. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm sorry, devastated. Paul. Paul, you're never going to look in, in your kid's you're eyes. You're never going to have yeah. what Brett has. Dude, if I woke up and I looked into Brett's children's <laughs> eyes, I'd fucking run screaming out the door. <laughs> <laughs> She's got that move. You know, how everybody's got their own cue move, their own uh, their own promo of how they behave and talk. Everybody's what? Got their your own, own promo? <laughs> sometimes it's Another more genism, dude. Eccentric. Sometimes you got your own it's promo. out in your face. Other times it's uh, barely noticeable, but it's there. And someone who's close and someone who loves their people will notice it. What will Paul end up with? Nothing. I'm looking Not at a this. goddamn thing. Destitute. And Paul's already expressed that he's not going to be able to have kids. Uh -huh. What do you mean expressed? Yeah, he expressed know. it, dude. I expressed. What's I confessed like it earlier, and now I expressed it. I expressed it. it. Yeah. I have a confession to make. <laughs> you confess. Yeah, you, yeah, Brett. You know what? When people have health conditions, <laughs> what you always hide behind when they attack you, it's I can't believe that. I can't. Oh, it's it's so mean. But when it's other people, it's it's fucking funny. Yeah. People are saying, I, why did this guy think this is funny? No, I didn't think this is funny. I think I thought the fact that Brett is now attempting to try it yet again to overtly claim that all these words were just, he was in on the joke. It's just, this is performance art for Brett. Oh, of course. It's laughable. What is that like for him that the only young people that are ever going to pay attention I love how he's trying to make it sound like he's sympathizing with Paul yeah. and he's really oh, just no. attacking him, too. Yeah. Of course. Is on a show where he does drugs, gets drunk, <laughs> and bites what? into their ear the whole time. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, that's the show. Those are the only kids that are ever going to pay attention yeah, to me. Yeah, Paul's always drunk. Paul's gotten drunk on the show uh, like a handful of times. Yeah, hardly ever. Yeah, I'm and, always drunk, And Paul dude. fucking very, very rarely I will vapes. cop to the weed. I, I do smoke a lot You're of weed on the drugs, show. Paul You're doing drugs, Paul. You're just a drug user, Paul. Abusing drugs. I kind of feel sorry for the guy a little bit. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, well, the feeling yeah, is mute. Actually, that's not true. I don't feel <laughs> sorry for you at all. Way. Just something I wanted to add. Let people know. Yeah. Yeah, whatever, Brett. Some people have been asking me lately and sending no. me emails. No one's been asking you or saying shit. Doing lately? No I've one cares. No one cares. Not a single Not human a being. single fucking person on the face of the earth gives a shit how you're doing. Nope. They never have. No one cares. If you die tomorrow, people are just going to be like, you lol, Brett's dead, you hear? Look at this v Viva Fidel Zigo. It's, P it's Pidel Gastro. Yeah. Yeah. You, got, you need to learn shit. Random Google image search. You don't know what's up. I've been hanging out with my family, and uh, I also what's got new? some my family, family members that used to live far my away who moved up to Missouri. Oh, my that's wonderful. That's a mistake. It's been nice. I feel bad for them. Yeah, why, why do they it's move anywhere really, near really Brett? Cool. I ended up having some barbecue situation. and Notice, notice that, he so. never talks about how his job is going. Yeah. I how's your, how's your job going, Brett? I'm not lovable guy on the internet anymore. <laughs> but anymore, in life, in ever. Reality, I've got everything going for me. So. Oh. Except some sort, sort of career. By. Citation needed. And the funny thing <laughs> is, I've always had all this greatness and wonderfulness before yeah, I what? even started. No, no, you, no, you didn't, Brett. I've always had all this greatness, you guys. Greatness and wonderfulness. So All right, well, then why don't you get the fuck off the internet and go enjoy that greatness and just leave everyone else alone. Yeah, go gum the rind Guess of what? Zeo de Dom. People who have these great, fulfilling lives don't feel the need to, like, hang it in front of others like, Paul Zingo sticks away, she <laughs> can't even have kids. Meanwhile, I got a beautiful family. If you really had a beautiful family that you were so fucking impressed and enamored with, you wouldn't feel the need to try to fucking hurt Paul, you stupid fuck. That's the action of a bitter, acrimonious fucking manatee, and you know it. 
that's just the way the situation crumbles oh. for particular individuals. Oh, you're in on it, Brett. You're By in the on way, it. I will be doing some more live shows out there. Oh, God, oh no. joy to the there, fucking there, world. There's nothing else of note. Joy to the world. It's joy. basically... There's about three about three minutes of this video right. out of seven Let's minutes. Let's take a look at whatever the fuck this is. Oh, dude, this is in, in memory of uh, Chester Bennington. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. It's Tongo, dude. Tongo. It's Tongo. Dude. Tongo! Tongo! And the Jews <coughs> walking in your shoes. Your shoes. Tango. <laughs> So now I can find you the real time. So much more than girl, baby. Can is there? I don't want to do it more like me. I'm just like you. Slay. Go Tongo. Yeah, Tongo. fly like an eagle, Tongo. Tongo has the pipes of a wow. fucking angel. Tongo, dude. Tongo is God. What a great tribute. Tongo beautiful, is God. Beautiful tribute. There is no God but Tongo. To Chester Bennington. Chester wow. is 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 uh is pleased. He's looking down from heaven and he's smiling <laughs> on this. Smiling on Tongo, dude. If if he'd have seen this, he probably would not have killed himself. Wow. Yeah, I think if he could have seen statement. if he could have seen this cover right here <laughs> before he passed, maybe he, he would have, did. He would <laughs> not. He no, because if he'd seen this, he'd have been like, you know what? Life is worth living. Lo life because is Tongo's out there. Yeah, Tongo's out there kicking ass for the rest of us. Thank you, Tongo. Thanks, Tongo. You're a fucking god among men, Tongo. You you <laughs> lovable fat bitch. That goes bitch. without saying. Oh yeah, yeah. Tongo shredding, dude. Uh, Shred on that, that guitar. That guitar doesn't even have strings on it. Yeah, he, whatever. Oh, he's Tongo doesn't oh, yeah, it, does. it, yeah, does. it, it does. does. It just got. You know what? Yeah. But he's not really playing. Here's the oh, thing: he is. if Tongo, oh. Tongo doesn't even need fucking strings. Tongo can shred without fucking strings. It does have strings, but he is Tongo, not really playing. Tongo can play. Tongo can touch a guitar any way he wants it doesn't and make matter. it make any sound possible. He's not even holding it right. Oh yes, he is. Tongo has a special way. Tongo knows how to play. Tongo shredding in that guitar. Yeah. You know, I just realized this is what Corpse Midget is going for. Yeah, he's. This is what he's this. trying to get to. It's the Tongo, but he can't. He can't touch. You tongo. can't touch. Tongo, he's kind of like a mixture. Midget. Can't touch Tongo. He's like a mixture of Tongo and Onision. Yeah. But less successful than both simultaneously. The Jews. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. belting it out. Man, dude, he's got Corpse pipes. Bridget needs to go to fucking Tongo boot camp, dude. Tongo camp. Yeah! Wow. Tongo! Tongo the Mongo, dude. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Tongo! Let's go! Yeah! Tongo! Dude, Tongo is fucking help us cup cope with this fucking pain, dude. Tongo is God! You know what? It's hard to express the loss to fucking Chester Bennington, but Tongo is really the voice of Tongo the people. is fucking God. We don't even need Chester Bennington. You this know, is the new lead Lincoln singer Park, of Lincoln Park right here. You have found a replacement. Tongo! By the way, uh... I, I forgot to tell you guys something at the beginning of the show that I wanted to, to say. I, I, don't, I don't know if I can do the burger challenge, man. I don't know. 
Because I went to McDonald's the other night and ate like three of those fuckers, and I felt like I was going to shit myself. Dude, so well, me and Paul are still ben, in. Ben, right, Paul? ben is out of the competition. I am bowing out. Paul and me, right? Me and Paul. Uh, yeah, well, let's, what let's competition tell the crowd did, about it. What did we agree to again? We agreed to a burger eating contest. Oh yeah, Paul. That, that, yeah, we're cool yep. with that. And also, we got to play each other in Mario Two. Yep, and, and uh, Zelda so Two. So what's what's so shouldn't we get like thirty burgers and see who can eat the most? Why stop at ten? Uh, I don't. I, I think it'll be a miracle if either yeah, one of us gets gonna, ten. Yeah, how, how many do you think you can eat? I like. I wanted to do like four, like the dude was doing with the McRibs. But yeah, I could eat no, four. You know, four what? doubles is a big fucking yeah. meal. Are you guys gonna do singles or doubles? He he wanted to do doubles. We're doing double cheeses, dude. Damn! I if we did three singles, and I felt we like shit, but I could have filled down think, one more. Yeah, if we do singles, if we do let's, singles. Do, let's do singles. So you guys get I can actually maybe. Yeah, do I, ten. I might be able to do like eight or ten singles. Yeah, maybe. let's do let's do singles. It'll, it'll keep it going a little longer. Yeah. I'll we'll have a timer, dude. We'll give you guys, like, maybe, like, say, two or three minutes in between each one. The hard part is the bun, man. That's the most filling part. They're good. Yeah, but they're toasty, though. They're just toasted gotta, on How on toasty? You've got to be careful. Well, you know what? I can fucking throw them in the microwave or something, You know, if you, give, if you give us two minutes between them, that's just going to get it to the belly to fill. you just got to gotta eat that nope. shit before you know uh, that you're getting full on it. Nope. You guys, if that's gotta be no, fucking we're gonna hard. Eat, no, you don't get to. Well, you don't get to set the no, fucking rules, I Scotty. Set the fucking no, rules, you fucking bitch. don't. No one appointed you head of shit. You're not the burger commissar. Yes, I am, bitch. Shut up. No. Fuck you, bitch. No. No, no, no. no. I have nothing to do with it. The good. Commissar. Commissar. Good. Good. <laughs> promises, promises. Okay. I'm not having anything to you're fucking gonna do, do with it. You're going to do whatever I say. No, fuck you, bitch. I'm going to shoot you then. Say. Why don't you fucking make me, fucking faggot? Why don't you make me? Why don't you make me? Why don't you, 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 you make me? I make you do shit. I'm telling you. Okay, so it's going to be interesting if you guys to eat it all in five minutes and be done. <laughs> you have no fuck. You have. Okay. Why, who'd be interested in that, dude? Oh, okay. everybody. Let's do this. Who wants to? Oh yeah, guys. Who wants oh, to watch two fat fucks eat burgers? No one. You guys, of course, they want to see that. It'll be on the next. that. By the way, it'll be on the next private show. It's not gonna be done in five fucking minutes. It's not gonna be done in five minutes. It'll be on the next private show. So become a patron. Oh, if you eat guys it as fast as possible. That. I fucking will time your ass, bitch. You're just gonna eat it one after the other, right? Yeah. You're gonna be done in five, ten minutes. Oh, all right, dude. I bet you you'll be done in five or ten minutes. How much you want to bet, bitch? Well, then it's gonna take five minutes a piece. Put your fucking money where your mouth is, fag. It took that one fat fuck. Ten bucks. It took that one. Shut up. Shut up. It took that one. Shut up. Nothing. It took that one fat fuck four minutes. No, I'm sorry, eight minutes to eat four McRibs. Oh, dude, you're not gonna eat fucking. That dude was a planetoid. You're not gonna eat ten, dude. Oh man. If we're eating singles, I'll, I'm, I'm pretty confident I get to ten. Uh, I bet you hundred dollars you won't. I, I think I'll get to eight pretty comfortably, but I don't think ten. I'll, yeah. I'm definitely getting to ten. You ain't getting to ten. I'm bitch. getting to ten. You bitch. ain't getting to ten, bitch. I'm getting to ten. You gonna tap, bitch? I'm getting to and ten. And a Colt forty five, dude. Colt. Uh, we're not, I'm not doing the Colt forty five. Oh, I'm, I'm not getting a fucking headache. That was the Fuck whole that. fucking no. thing. I no. I All said right. specifically I ain't doing the Colt forty five. You know what? Then I want a big gulp or something. Colt for Colt for. I'll do a Fago or an RC Cola or something. A two liter of fucking Coke, bitch. I ain't fucking having a headache for two days because I drank a, a cold 45. Then, dude? Well, maybe. We'll see. How about Fresca? TJ's going to have a headache for two days because he drank a cold 45. I will. Oh, that my shit's... God. Why don't you... I'm going to give you a headache for two days from slapping you in the fucking head, You bitch. have any menstrual blood in your panties, uh, Mary Jane? Uh, yeah, yeah, damn, I'm gonna, dude. I'm going to fucking shove it. my tampon down your throat, he bitch. Damn, damn, dude. TJ quit smoking. Most moths lack mouths, so they die within a week due to starvation. No, that's bullshit. Get out of here, you fucking faggot. Dude, roasted. The biggest lie in that Brett Keen video is that he knows himself. Cool. Scotty is spurging out. What are you, when, how's that worth because noting? Because fucking TJ is trying How to How is fucking, that worth even fuck fucking you, saying? Fuck you, Mike Todd, 4491. I'm trying to give the people what they want, bitch. Yeah, fuck Enemy you. Enemy of the people, And I say fuck you because you're just so, stating the obvious. I mean, do you want to just take a vote? We can, we can take a vote on up, what? Sky. Why don't you come stop me, motherfucker? Vote you for punk, what? You punk ass bitch. We do the burger eating contest TJ's way or Scotty's way? Scotty's way? Um, Every few minutes, dude. Every t So, Scotty, that's I gonna say. That's gross, though. Those fucking burgers are going to be all fucking. That's what I'm saying. We got to fucking just eat that soggy. shit. Boom, boom, boom. Burger, burger, you burger. You know what? We can fucking put them in the microwave for you guys. Let's wow, see that's, oh, yeah, that's going to make them better. Let's see what the people want. Oh, like they're, that, they like they're fucking quality to begin with or something. I like them. Oh, I like them. They're well, already, you have no fucking taste, bitch. They're already fresh out of the microwave when you get them. I know. That's what I'm saying. They'll be fucking fine, dude. Fuck me. Fuck you. How should be do and You the, know what? I could beat TJ's ass in this burger eating contest because he's got a fucking stomach. Well, then small why don't you enter then? Stomach. Why don't you enter then? Fuck yeah, I'm gonna whoop your fucking ass, All bitch. All right, three way Fuck burger you, contest bitch. then. I'm gonna fucking the whoop your ass. Threat, dude. <laughs> like you beat my ass in skee ball? 
Oh, dude, I can fucking eat more than your fucking lazy fat ass. Three dude, men, dude, 30 Cheetah's burgers. ass cannot fucking eat. I've seen Cheetah. He cannot eat shit. Oh, you don't understand, Scotty. Oh, I'm ready, dude. TJ's way, Scotty's way. Three men, 30 burgers. Three men, 30 burgers. I'm gonna fucking I might need win, more bitch. than We might need more than that, because I'm going to fucking... I'll pack away 30 by my damn self. Oh, okay. Oh, my God. This Let's is getting it, out of dude. control. You're going to pack right. away 30? So there is now a poll on the Drunken Peasants Twitter. I might. Go to the Drunken Peasants Twitter and vote how we're going to do how this shit. How should we do the burger? Oh, we're, we're going to shit win, the super chats. We should probably get over there. You know what? I, I'm going to fucking win, dude. So, Ben, you and Alicia, I... I don't know what you're talking about. Who knows that fuck? Dear know. peasants, please tell my beloved brother, Andrew, to quit Mormon... Yeah, yeah, Jesus. We already did that. We already did it. Feather-wearing midget aliens will form an alliance... Yeah, alliance start a war against Paul, and the weed demons will spank all the people <laughs> who aren't onion enough for the Lord Zool until you say L LSU, pay up Paul. Okay. <laughs> Do you think Milo will regain his popularity ever again? I mean, I, I, I think he's still got he's still quite a bit of it. I mean, he's got a best-selling book and shit, yeah. whatever. I don't think he's ever going to get so, back to exactly where he was. But. So, so just to clarify for everyone voting, TJ's way is just eat all the burgers at once. Scotty's way is to space Every them minutes. out. Yeah, space right, now, right now, TJ's way is 57 to 43. Why? You guys are now fucking stupid. Skinny but you know what? doesn't matter because I'm going to fucking win anyway. Skinny people can eat more than fat people because their stomach has more elasticity due Put to their being less me, fat, putting pressure on it. Whatever, Wes Lindstrom. You don't know what's what. Scotty, I think, is correct. TK is mu too much of a fuckhead he retard. Is, but I'm going to win, Thanks so for the $10, queer. I have three grown daughters. You guys are the sons I've never had. Ha have Go some money. Vote Keep making TJ. me laugh. A vote for me is a vote against Thanks, TJ. Thanks, fat old guy. The best part of the 24-hour stream was when you guys went out to eat with Billy. It was, like opening of it was like the opening of Reservoir Dogs. I wasn't there for that. Scotty's way, even though he'll still lose. I'm gonna fucking win, dude. You should Fuck check you, out bitch. Poisoning the Well and Aiden Paladin. They'd be great. Pa Aiden Paladin, rather. They'd be great to have on the show, and remember to subscribe <laughs> and comment and rape. Aiden Paladin. Whoa. That rhymes. This violent Canadian is coming to the next meetup. No, we're gonna bitches. be arrested, buddy. Yeah, uh, you keep your maple no syrup Canadians drinking allowed. acid back in Canada. I think Chester killed himself because he wanted to be with his guardian angel, Chris Cornell. Maybe you're right. I think he heard Tongo destroy his fucking magnum opus and was and he like, was like, "Man, I'll never do it as I'm good never, as Tongo." Never reached Tongo levels. Tongo is god. Dude, how are you gonna feel when I fucking beat you? Say dude? this guy's name, Scotty. Say my name, please. Pluz. Pluz. Okay, his name is Pluz. So his name is Pluz. 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 Neo Reptile. Neo Reptile. Neo Reptile. So even if whoever wins, you let's even say your shitty way wins. Uh -huh. So if I eat ten before you, I win. No. You what if we run out? What if we no. run out? Well, you got to eat till you throw in the towel. Well, I'm gonna fucking beat you, bitch. So we'll what, see. Okay, so if I eat ten, uh huh, and you don't eat, and, and you eat ten, well, what happens if we run out? I guess we tie then. Okay. Well, I'm gonna, the, the the fucking best you can fucking hope for, dude, is a tie. I watched a pirated version of Mouth of the Manatee on YouTube. Here's your five dollars. Forgive me, please, senpais. Well, you're that's nice of you. You're, you're forgiven. Thanks, I guess, for money. You've been given your pardon. We Pardon. absolve you. We absolve you of your sins and such. Go with God, Scotty, you're a featherweight? No, I'm a fucking heavyweight, bitch! I'm gonna knock both these bitches out! I mean... Fuck. Anything could happen. Yeah. No. Yeah. So Paul, you ain't even my, in this competition. No, Paul real, might as well just no, drop my, out. It's between only, me and Scotty My only now. real competition here is Paul, dude. It clearly isn't you. Bullshit. You're, I'm, it's you and me now. Paul ain't even in this no more. Oh, uh, whatever, dude. <laughs> me and Paul the only, have the only chance. I'm fine with I'm fine with letting you guys awesome have, have shirt uh, ben. a brother. Oh, you ain't getting out of it. You ain't getting out of it. Oh, yeah, shut the fuck you, up then, you. bitch. Favorite yeah, Nine Inch Nails song or songs? I like the perfect drug. Um, whew, That's a fucking tough one. I like... Uh, uh, ring finger. That's a good one. What is that fucking? Song I like. Uh, I like. Um, oh, fuck. What's it called? Where's the fucking heresy? One? Heresy's a good. Dude, where's the one really where they're good, in that yeah. fucking, they're, that giant fucking room and they're all in cages and head shit. like a hole. Yeah. Uh, the becoming. No, yeah. I that yeah. Was, yeah. Gave the becoming. Up I like the yeah, becoming. Was, well, what, one of those ones. I forget the name. Of the good one, shit. One. Love the show. Please have. Mag yeah. Okay. We already know. Magog of Morskar. Also have Jeff Holiday and Wizard of Cause on the show again. Well, I'll have Jeff on. Again Jeff. Soon. Jeff. Jeff will be on again soon. Hello, Benjamin. Hello, Benjamin. Hello. Is Tongo Hi. a prophet of Evan LeFevre? We'll have to ask Evan. Maybe. 
Just got off proba- probation and tasks, so I'm blazing up. Here's money, so you may Thank do you, the same. Thank you, Oberyn Martell. Oh, I think I skipped this guy. Oh, you did. What do you guys think of Rammstein? Rammstein! Uh, I haven't liked some of their Freddie newer Mercury. stuff, but yeah. I like some of their, their other I like stuff. That, I like some of their music. That album that Du Hast is on is pretty cool. Yes. Yeah, say so. I, say so. I, I saw them uh, at the Family Values tour oh, back cool. in the day. Have you guys ever heard of Zero Gravity Sex Fantasy? No, but it sounds pretty interesting. Sounds amazing. We should, we'll probably play it on the show at some point. I know you guys did meth in Atlanta. No, you don't. I've you don't never know been to Atlanta. Shh. Could Tommy from the Bronx bench TJ and Paul and no. Billy the Fridge no. all at once? No, no. Man not is, Superman. Probably not. No man is that strong. Uh, with the moths, it's the larvae that eat the clothes, not the adults oh, themselves. Oh, well, cool. Suck cool. a dick. Thank That's you not for the true. Knowledge. You're a liar. Paul always loses. He still owes ten yes! billion dollars. Hashtag billion? Team Scotty. I'm gonna fucking win. Bet on me. Bet on the fucking winning, Kirk. How do I send videos? Uh, you can send them to the Drunken Peasants Facebook. Uh, you can also put them in the Drunken Peasants Discord. There's a section for that. The only, the only uh, advantage... You can do it. You can dude, post them in the uh, subreddit as well. Dude, me, dude. The, but I'm going to fucking win. The, the, only, the only advantage I would say TJ has is that he actually likes McDonald's and Scotty thinks McDonald's is garbage. I don't care. I'm still going to fucking beat TJ. And, but, but I guarantee you TJ will eat a bunch of fucking food earlier that oh, day TJ's before gonna tap, he comes dude. and, and does TJ's going to fucking tap out before me. I'm going to win. If you really want to win, what you should do is not eat all day up until that point and maybe even do exercise beforehand. Oh, I'm going to win. You gotta got to eat a little down. something, dude. You can't you can't go total empty stomach into eating a big giant meal, dude. You'll tap out That's early. Normally you got to have like a little bit of food in the morning, dude. You got to give a little meal. I'm just going to eat normal. I'm not going to prepare something. at all. I'm just going to show you how I'm better just off out the gate. Do whatever you want, Without bitch. no training. Oh, it's fine. Theory. How, how I the weight loss it? competition go when you did, did it that G-time, time, Johnny. How's your weight loss going? G-time, just Johnny, <laughs> is an SCP with dimensional transcending capabilities. He's here to warn us about an impending doom. Damn. I don't know. I ain't seen no Paul workout videos of late. Yeah, there's no videos. I still... I, oh, I'm, you're, I've just, still so you're, you're just not sharing loss. it with the people. I see. I've maintained the you're weight loss. You're just a greedy fuck. Just want to keep all your weight loss Dude, to you yourself. you gained weight on more fucking weight lo- weight uh, <laughs> videos <laughs> than we've done. You gained weight on my butt. Did you Jordan not gain Patricia. weight? That is true, though. You did <laughs> gain weight. True, though. It's true. We're going, oh, it's a great oh, color oh, argument, it's isn't it, you fat shit? You, TJ, oh, you smoke a oh, fucking cigarette, You're so TJ. clever, all yeah. you can do is smoke T- me. Oh. TJ's having a cigarette fit, dude. Smoke a fucking dude. cigarette, TJ. Paul, you know what? I, I think quit. I'd like to have I a cigarette. I quit. I don't give a fuck if you do. Go yes, smoke do. as many cigarettes as you want, bitch. Don't lie. Paul, don't give me a hug because I'm squeaking. You at the meetup, best nin song is Reptile. I like Reptile. It's pretty good. Paul is fat. <laughs> Paul is dumb. Okay, Ben, calm down. What? I'm, I'm going to have to put you back in your cage. Just use Paul the, will just be filled with TJ. rhino cum. That's a yes. Don't threaten me with a good time. I'm a biologist and confirm that Brett is a species of sentient mold <laughs> that grew within his fat flaps and engulfed him years ago. Wow. Neat. It's Wait, like swamp so it thing. took him over? Yeah, he was once a man. But then the mold between his fat flaps Dude, grew. Maybe Paul wow. and, and Paul, overcame him. Maybe Brett is the origin of that uh, the game Last of Us, dude. Scotty has done ten thousand push-ups. He will kick Paul's racist Holy ass. Shit. Damn, dude. Ten thousand fucking push-ups. Ten, 000, well, ten fucking thousand right, push-ups. I'll, I'll admit, guys, it was only nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Wow. So you're not quite up to Howard Bloom's level, then. Um, I'm approaching. Not it. quite yet. N- not almost. Soon enough, though. Soon. You'll be at the bloom level. Man, we're getting all kinds of super chats today. Take $5 for introducing me to Tongo. His angelic voice has healed my sad, Praise withered Lord, little brother. heart. Praise, Praise the Tongo. Lord. Hey, that Sylvester Stallone versus Arnold Schwarzenegger segment was awesome. Awesome. When is the next one? Oh, Pacino. How about Pacino versus De Niro? That I- one is sure to be that, great. We good could do show. That. That's good. That could happen. Yeah, some counterpointless. I'd have to go with Pacino on that one because I think De Niro is overrated as I mean, fuck. Yeah, I'd go with Pacino over De Niro. Oops. Only slightly, though. See, I just don't like De Niro. Oh. I like De Niro. Oh, he's, he's Paul right. sucks at Mortal Kombat. That's no true. shit. <laughs> we all really There's suck There's a at- famous video about how bad Paul sucks at no, Mortal Kombat. No, no, no. It Mortal was Kombat. the screen. Oh, yeah, it was just the screen. The screen is fucking and, laggy. And the nicotine. Okay, but you know what? The I screen, beat, I beat the you. nicotine. Is there lag at the screen at my house? No. 
Okay, there you go then. Hey, peasants, you should have Dr. Randomer Cam on sometimes. Does anyone know who that is? No. No, I, I don't. don't. Dr. Randomer Cam. I guess Cam. I'll look them up. We'll look them Do up. Do you know who that is, Paul? No. no. None of us know. None of us know who that is. So but, I mean, We're not with it. We're not hip. So it looks, it's based on the vote, it's looking like everyone's going to start with 10 burgers in front of them and whoever eats the most and doesn't throw up wins. Cool. Uh, it doesn't All matter. I'm going to fucking tie. win. But, you know, there's plenty of time left to vote in that poll. Contest title, Bricks uh, 4, Eggs 3, Burgers. No. I don't uh, like it. Mm -mm. Yeah, I don't, it doesn't make any Not sense. Happening. I love you guys. I'm an actress. If I become successful, will you have me on as a guest one day? Absolutely. Yeah, why not? If you become successful, you're going to be like, those losers? Yeah, you're just going to be like, <laughs> I wouldn't appear on that shit. Couldn't fucking pay me to appear on that show with those fucking idiots. If you're, if you're famous enough, your publicist is going to let you know not to appear on shows oh, like yeah, this. For sure. You know... That's not going to help your career. Look what we did to Milo. We can yeah, do it to you. We, we could do the same thing. We're just an albatross. That Steve Hofstetter guy, he was going to become the most famous comedian in America at some point. Career's over. But now his career is basically just spiraling down the drain after his appearance on our show. It's true. Paul has milk bags and owes $15 billion. Jesus, it's going up. Scotty is a god given to us by the Voto Demons. This guy has a hard on for you, Scotty. Because I fucking called you and Paul out in this competition. Bullshit. You I'm know what? fucking win. I can't wait to see both of you motherfuckers go down and have it proved. You can't wait to see me win? Proved once and for all. You can't wait to see me win? Who the supreme fucking peasant is. I'm going to win, dude. It's sad that it, you guys even think okay. you can compete. It's sad that you guys even <laughs> believe sad, for a fucking right. second that, that you are even worthy of competing you know against gonna me. Happen? It's going to be, at the end, it's going to be me and Paul, dude. TJ's going to tap. Paul, you know TJ's going to tap after, like, five Oh, yeah, he's going to get a tummy ache. Oh, my tummy I can't drink a 40 because I got myself a widow headache. <laughs> oh, I can't drink my wicker. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I, let's see you voluntarily give yourself a fucking he splitting headache, bitch. Oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. That's your comeback. Cry me Great. a fucking oh, river, dude. I, maybe I will, and I'll Pop fucking drown you in it, too. Pop up your pussy and fucking yeah, calm yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smoke a cigarette, You TJ. guys should have Julius Caesar we're, on the show. We're He's working, dead. We're working on him. You should get Rucka Rucka Ali as a guest. He made a great song about Sargon of Akkad. Cool. Sounds, uh, sounds wonderful. Whatever. What do you guys think about having Philip DeFranco on the show? Huh, no. That, that would never happen. Thoughts on the new Star Trek Discovery trailer? Uh, disappointing. I ain't seen yeah, it. The, the fucking uh, Klingons look like purple oh turd monsters. Why did they go with the J.J. Abrams film design for the Klingons? Uh, I'm Horrible. not sure. It's ass. They look so much better in every other incarnation of Star Trek. They look worse on this one because it's they don't have the fucking budget that yeah. the J.J. Abrams people have. It's like they tried to go for that, but with a TV budget. <laughs> and you're just like, oh, it's ass. I just, I don't know, man. Klingons are supposed to be cool. They're not supposed to look like fucking Dude, living turds. I, <laughs> I am not optimistic about the show. I mean, I'm gonna give it a chance. Okay, but I, mean, you guys I understand see, uh, that Star Trek is supposed to be progressive and shit, but why is it all bitches? Did you guys see uh, uh, Seth MacFarlane's? Uh, yeah, he's doing some Star Trek uh, parody. It right? looks better. Yeah, it actually looks better than Discovery. It yep. also looks bad, but it looks better than Discovery. Um. I think it's probably about time to go into the post show. I don't know. Have we been on for three the hours post yet? The show. The poser show. I'm going to fucking win. Yes, Scotty Kirk is a skinhead. It believes in me, TJ. Scotty Kirk is a skinhead. I am going to fucking win. Put your money on the fucking winner of this group. Yeah, we've been on for about three hours. Yep. Let's go. Uh, we're going to go into the post show. If you guys want to see the post show, you got to get DP on demand, which for a limited time only is 33% off for our summer sale. Check it out. Also, 25% off all our T-shirts. And be sure to come and see us at the DP meetup. On August 22nd. You should. At the come Fun House the show. in Seattle. It's the fucking place to go. You're gonna kick your ass. You're gonna kick your own ass if you miss it. It's yep. fucking. It's gonna be spectacular. Check the fucking link below. Get your tickets now. Five bucks cheaper if you get in ahead of time. Save some fucking oh, yeah. money. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You could use that five bucks to buy a drink. Yeah. Bonus. Buy for me. Drink. Your first drink is on us. I am gonna fucking win, people. Okay, the champ is here. You mean to tell me you're gonna go to DP meetup, get drunk, and you're not gonna smoke any cigarettes at this fucking meetup? Nope. The fucking champ. is nope. Fucking here. You're you so you're not gonna smoke any cigarettes at the meetup? No. no. According to him, no. I ain't smoking shit. How, how do you feel about that? Dude, it's gonna be I'm done. Fire, do you dude. believe I'm done. him? Do you believe him, Scotty? 
I have a hard time believing that, but let's see. I wish him the best. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna yeah, act. I'm not, I'm not gonna say, against him with but the motherfucking cigarette. You know what? Here, here's the thing. Like over a year, well, multiple times, TJ's been like, "I'm quitting smoking cigarettes," and then. Like, the first few times, I'm like, oh, good for you. But then, like, after he failed, like, the 20th time, I'm just kind of like, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't bitch. think so. We'll I, see. We'll see, man. But I don't, I, don't, I don't think so. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Because, you know, uh, I, was, I was on Chantix and shit, and it's giving me horrible fucking insomnia. But it has uh, blocked my nicotine receptors, and I think I've already gone through the worst of, like, withdrawal fucking shit. So. It seems like you're going through it now. Oh, oh I mean, it's, I still am. But it, I feel like it was worse a few days ago, even when I was still kind of smoking, but I couldn't get anything out of it because it's blocking the fucking receptors, so I'm I, still just an angry piece of shit. I guess we'll uh, talk about it in the post show. Everyone, yeah. subscribe to DP On Demand. Follow the link in the description. Good night, everybody. Watch the post show. Bye-bye, people. Bye-bye. Post show.